Smash.
Hello. <laughs> I'm just here jamming. How you guys doing? Hello, hello. <laughs> I'm so excited to play this. I am very, very excited. It has been many a years, many, many a years, and having the ability to play it again and it looking nice and sexy in its remake, I'm so ready. Are you just starting today? Yes, I am. I, uh, the fresh start after, oh, I don't know how many years since I played the original. Hey, Flavor, how you doing? Welcome in. I, yeah, I played it back in its original release. Yeah, this is, this is the, the new release of it, the new launch. You know, after it's been technically re-released like three times prior to this between FES and uh, the portable version. And I think there was, I think there was one other. Um, but now this is a modernized version that plays a lot more like uh, visually like P5. So, and also, hey, Foxy, EP and L. So I'm here for your chill vibes. I appreciate that. <laughs> I'm really excited for this. And this will definitely be a nice cozy game. Um, nice power friendship. Occasionally uh, putting a gun to my head. But yeah. <laughs> I never seen Persona, so I'm excited. Yeah, it's actually one of my favorite franchises between um, Persona Three and uh, Final Fantasy. What was it? Final Fantasy Six, I think, were the two games that really got me into RPGs, or more specifically, JRPGs. So. Who ordered all this fucking anime titty? Man, I don't know, Perny. This time, this time is one of those times it wasn't me that ordered the titties. I'm okay with them being here, but like I didn't, I didn't order them this time. Maybe next time. How you doing, Brittany? Hope everyone's doing well. I am just making sure I posted everything on socials and stuff like that, and then we can get ready. I have everything pulled up already. I always have the game pulled up ahead of time. I might. Hmm. I was debating on plugging in a controller and just kind of getting cozy, but um, I'm too lazy to find out where my cord is for my controller. So we're just going to have to mouse and keyboard. Maybe for Wednesday's stream, um, I'll plug in a controller so I could just like wrap a blanket around me and uh, play some nice uh, Persona. But um, I ordered the Barra anime titties. Need man pillows <laughs> for my oldest. They will cure me. I mean, that is a pretty good cure. That is a pretty good cure. Can't go wrong with them titties. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> But I'm just like, I, I have very specific anime characters that came to my head the moment I read uh, Bara anime titties. <laughs> I'm just like, oh god. But yes, I am excited to play this. Give me one sec. Mm -mm -mm. Thank you for shouting out them. I don't know why gay ass got um flag there, but um. <laughs> um. Need big bar of titties to, to cure me. I mean, it cures all. Mm -mm -mm. My eyes are being so derpy, and that's also because I'm sitting in the dark, but I wanted the ultimate comf. I wanted, I wanted to be so comfortable because I'm sitting here wrapped in a nice, fluffy fleece blanket, ready to go back into the world of Persona. I haven't actually finished my uh, run of five yet. I've played four into the dirt. Um, I played three into the dirt, but I can guarantee you I'm probably not going to remember most of the actual like stuff. And I'm not sure if they change things either. So I'm just going to like go into it like I've never played it before and just kind of uh, slam my head against whatever I don't remember. Um, I remember all of the plot, but uh, again, I don't know how much they're going to change it. Uh, Persona Night, let's go, right? Uh, got me saying, well, <laughs> yeah, right? It's like, surely, uh, the, the, the double uses, the double dipping in, in the, in the horny will, like, be the, the, uh, the ultimate cure, you know? <laughs> yes, you get to e use that emote. I kind of wish that your, um, the numeric in your emote, the three, was actually a four. So that, you know, um... It could be like 4K. The double positive is a negative. Yeah, you see, you see it. All right, there's going to be an ad, I think, in a second. I think is what I just saw. So I'll let that ad run and then we can get started. Actually, I could force it. 
Here, we're gonna do it. We're gonna do 60 second ad for those of you that don't have subs, and then um, we'll get on this. So let me run that. In the meantime, we can keep just chatting. I saw that pop up. Yeah, force it. There we go. All right. So when that's done, we'll get in on it. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Also gives me time to clean my glasses because holy crap. They are insane right now. I fell asleep on the couch and apparently it just attracted every ounce of like lint on that couch. I need to like ro lint and roll that couch. Holy crap. Yeah, thank you for that shout out as well. Mm -mm -mm. I opened up the window that has um, Mushi's emotes in OBS, and there's no close button, and it's over like my member list. So like I just ha perpetually have Mushi's like window at the top. It's just perpetually there. When Prinny when Prinny's here, Prinny Prinny will shout out any any other creator to help support them. I don't usually have the opportunity to while I'm playing a game, trying to use what one brain cell I have to do things and whatnot. But Prinny freaking kills it whenever uh, people are uh, when she's here. <laughs> oh my god! All right. Um. Let me pull up the game. Let me move this over here. Put that back over top of it. That back over top of it. Do you want my kidney? I mean, a lurk from PC, but I can stay awake. I just walked in through the door from work. All right, sounds good, Foxy. Thank you for the lurk. And also, wait, I say like I can't stay awake. Okay, that's all good. That's all good. You you rest. Have a good uh, have a good rest of your night and good sleep. Uh, this is the tenth time today I have popped into a stream and gotten a random shout out. I mean, that's good. That's awesome. All right, let's switch over to the game screen. Wah. Hello, hello. Thank you, thank you. All right, we'll go down on that. Unfortunately, this game only. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. Actually. No, I'm not gonna do that. No, no, stop, 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 stop. What did I just do? All right, I'm breaking things. Don't worry about it. We're gonna go right into it. I'm just playing on normal. I have back in the day, I played it on like everything, all the things. But we're just gonna do normal. It's gonna be nice and cozy. Be nice and cozy. Time waits for no one. All are equal in its flow. All lives born to their ends. You, who would protect the glimmer of the finite future. You have a single year. Go forth and live in the time given to you. Even in these halcyon days of repose, let your heart guide you and never stray from its path. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I'm so excited. And then you get hit by a truck, isekai. Oh yeah, you're definitely you're definitely gonna get the uh, the diabetes from this community, man. Everyone's so sweet. Okay, sorry. <laughs> I was gonna pause and also stop the audio whenever. I might see if I can modify the folder. The file. Just put it to my I keep running in the background. I know how to do that. Which I'll, I'll mess with it tonight. Come on. There's no way I can't. Hell yeah, flavor. My fellow blue-haired gamer, let's go. My fellow butterfly enjoyer. Gamer. This is the final train bound for Tatsumi Port Island. Please board before the scheduled 
I think, I think this one's still my favorite out of the quote-unquote popular ones. Two is really good too, but that's not a popular one. Three, four, and five are. Oh, um, sussy. <laughs> For sure. I'm very much 18 plus. Ain't quite a lewd tuber, but, uh... I make the comments. Okay. I arrived so late. Better hurry up. He was at the dorm. That's where I'll be staying from now on. It should be just up ahead. I, I, I know for a fact the funniest part about this intro to this game is that Homie is just not bothered by like literally anything. He shows up and he's just like, wow. That's crazy. Everything went green. There's like blood stains everywhere. You know, this isn't a problem at all. <laughs> this is this is perfectly fine. You know, the giant coffin here. Is this coffin? Yes. Yeah. So you're gonna say this to every single one. I wonder what's in these things. What's this doing here? I don't know, man. You tell me. So that's easy. Digging balls. Fantastic. Yes. I think it's over here. Yeah. Wah wah. To be fair, if I just like, if I was tired and I was just walking through a town I don't know and things were just happening, I would just be like, yeah, yeah, this is, this is fine. I just want to go to bed. Iwatodai dorm. I guess this is it. Yeah. What, what inclination gives you that? <laughs> it's like damn this this town uh this town does some weird stuff doesn't it <laughs> damn they just leave coffins out all the people disappear at a certain time like i don't know that's that's crazy but that bed sounded real good welcome i was gonna play it in japanese voices but just for you guys being cozy you're late who, who, who want the audio the english audio i'm gonna do that I usually only play Japanese games in Japanese. <laughs> if you wish to proceed, sign your name here. It's a contract. Okay. There's no need to be scared. Oh, of course not. Perfectly normal. Can I just go to bed? Like All it says is that you accept full responsibility mm -hmm. for your actions. A subby person? Japanese is way too hard for me, but I am scared I may have to learn it for my studies. It's 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 not too bad. The, I think the hardest part about learning Japanese is mostly with the um, learning kanji, man. Kanji fucking sucks. <laughs> I mean, even like a native Japanese speaker could tell you that it sucks. Um, all right, we're just going to go with my name. If I know how to spell my name, how do I go to the second part? Oh, there we go. I was debating on just using the canon name, but yeah, we're going to do this. Yeah, 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 do that. Be fully immersed, you know? Good. Is it good? Time is something no one can escape. It delivers us all to the same end. Again. You can't plug your ears or cover your eyes. Oh, fair, fair, fair. And so, it begins. Yeah, this is perfectly fine. Perfectly normal. Cre you know, creepy child in a place with um, no lights. And um, my character's like, yeah, fair enough. How are you here at this hour? I'm not used to her um, English voice. Wait. Hello. Hi. This auto sometimes. Oh, there we go. Okay, I stopped the auto by hitting space. I think there we go. I was like, 
I didn't think you'd arrive so late. My name Other is girl. Mizuru Kirijo. I'm one of the students who live in the storm. The ultimate hey. character. He's a transfer student. It was a last minute decision to assign him here. He'll eventually be moved to a room in the boys dorm. Is it okay for him to be here? I guess we'll see. That Mitsuru was like, <laughs> was like sweating for a second, but it's just like a little mark on my screen. I was like, why is she sweating? Call me Takeba. Um, why do you have a gun? Huh? Well, uh, it's sort of like a hobby. Mm -hmm, yeah. I, mean, no. I too carry around guns for a hobby. Duh. You know how it is these days. <laughs> it's for self-defense. It's not a real gun. Getting late. I feel like you would still get very much arrested in Japan for having something that looks like a fake gun. Why don't you get some rest? There are people who go around with obviously toy katanas and get arrested. Or at least it confiscated. I gotta do some more reading, so I'm gonna back to that lurk. Okay. Oh, have a good study. Appreciate the lurking. Do you have any questions? Um, does that kid live here too? What kid? What are you talking about? Come on, that's not funny. Uh, Yukari doesn't seem to know what I'm talking about. Uh, can I ask you something? On your way here from the station, was everything okay? You don't like Yukari? Why? Why? I don't. I don't have an issue with anyone in this game compared to like. Four and five, there's certain characters and I'm like, eh. Um, what do you mean? You don't know? I guess that means you're fine. Oh, well, okay. Don't worry about it then. I'd better get going. Like, I think honestly I prefer her. Um, I'm sure you still Oh, I mean, fair. Let's save them for later. I think I still like her more than like Chie and four. I think. I don't know. I have to replay four and be like, do I? Life in the dorm starts today. The room came pre furnished and everything. I'm spent. I should put my things in the closet and get to bed early. Yes, you should. EP time. Press H to save when it's displayed. Rewinding to a previous event. When you save your game, it also saves a little bit of your past. You can go back to that time by opening the menu with tab, going to system, and clicking rewind. When you select a rewind slot, you will be returned to a point where you can roam freely shortly before you saved your game. Note that the rewind f rewind re rewind function does not save your new starting point automatically. Use this function. Make sure to continue your game as necessary. Uh, yeah, that's a tutorial. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And then we do a little first save. Whoa. Whoa, what do you have to say about your closet? Purchase DLC can be redeemed by checking the closet in your room. I should put my stuff away in the closet. Well, good thing I clicked it. I see my tired face reflected in the mirror. I should go to sleep early today. Yeah, you, I mean, you should just sleep whenever, man. I just woke up. It's the fridge. There's nothing in particular that I want to chill right now. You don't chill your clothing? There's nothing on the shelf yet. I should probably rest on the bed instead of sitting in the chair. You know what? Why don't you tell me not what to do? Thank you. Tired? I'll watch TV another day. I mean, I sleep with, like, something going, so, like... Turn that on. Sleeping in your bed will allow you to advance time. To yeah, yeah. Maybe, yeah. School starts tomorrow. I should go to sleep early, so I'm ready for the next first day of school. Hey. It always has to start with you going to school. <laughs> it's gotta be it's gotta be like your first day of school, new person there. That's the, the persona the persona staple. It's just uh It's Takeba. Are you awake? Uh good morning. I was debating on just ellipsis thing. <laughs> I'm not here, man. I'm sleeping. I've been asked to show you the way to school. Are you ready to go? Um, yeah, I'm ready. Great, let's head out. Hey, anime cutscene. Let's go. This is how we'll be getting to school every day. It's a monorail. Pretty cool, huh? Oh, I've never seen a monorail. It almost feels like we're flying over the ocean. Oh, by the way, our school's at the last stop on this line. It's called Tatsumi Port Island. 
Have you heard of it? The whole thing's man-made, and our school's smack dab in the middle. Oh, look! There it is now! Be so pretty to ride on that rail that's like right over the water. Morning. Well, here we are. Allow me to welcome you to Gecko Khan High School. I hope you like it. It is very pretty, thank you. That was fast. Did you just say you were <laughs> doing that? <laughs> All right, you have you have a good sleep flavor. We'll tell you more when you get there. Oh, well, that about does it. Any questions before I go? Have a good night. Uh, any questions before I go? What classes are you? What class are you in? Me? I don't know. I haven't looked at the classroom assignments yet. Hey, about like Imagine. Don't tell anyone what you saw. Okay? See you. What, that I saw coffins, everything going green, blood stains, a creepy child, and you having a gun? I'll make sure to write it in my blog. There's a crowd forming in front of the bulletin board. Maybe I'll take a peek before going to the faculty office. Learning about bedrock formation. Ah, uh, okay, okay. Looking around, press V to focus your view closer in on the protagonist, or O will reset the camera. Some locations the camera will be locked in place uh, whenever it's available. Using the camera will help you get a good sense of your environment. Okay. What? I don't see my name. What should I do? What should I do? Uh, go to the office or whatever the hell they have here. Oh great, I have the worst teacher ever. Oh, there it is. Class F, huh? Homeroom teacher is... What? Miss Toriyumi? I guess she is older than I don't know why I don't like how he said that. I don't know why. I'm... <laughs> Have a good night, Flavor. I was hoping to be with Miss Kano. Uh, there's no need for them to post the names of the kids who are going to be in our class. I mean, we'll never see them again after we graduate anyways. Oh, well, that's... You're, you're fun, man. Uh, it's a statue of a sword and a staff. It looks very well made. I wonder what meaning it holds. Uh, it's going to be the starting weapons of um, Kingdom Hearts. That's what it's going to be. What? Cause, what are you doing? Why are you wearing a jersey? Uh, what do you mean, why? We've got practice after class, remember? But we've got to attend the opening ceremony and go to class before all that. Hurry and head into your classroom so you can change into your normal uniform. What? But I just... Okay, okay, fine. Just quit glaring at me. So where's the bulletin board with all the class assignments? It's literally right there, Cause. You're in class F. I'm in a different homeroom, so I can't keep an eye on you all the time. I think time. you'd actually get in trouble for wearing uh, your non-uniform and, and whatnot. Good. Even though it's still technically a uniform. And kids these days don't know how to show respect for their elders. Oh yeah, this man. Uh, we're their teachers. We live longer than them. But Moriyama and her friends had to pull that on me at the beginning of the term. Sorry to interrupt, but I need to get back to the managing the shop. Even you're shooing me away? Some way to start the school year. I don't think my nerves can take this. Alright, alright. You want me to put <laughs> to order more of those cream-filled breads you like so much, right? I mean, yes, please. Me me back here, yes, please order those. Could have just asked. Yeah, I love I love people who are like, I'm your elder, and therefore you should care about everything I have to say. I love that. In the faculty office, um, I think that's this way. Actually, I'm new here, so you should probably ask someone else. Me trying to be helpful. I think Nox tried to raid in with me, but it didn't bring me in. So you found me? Alright, sounds good. How you doing? Welcome in. <laughs> Thank you, Leona. Thank you for the follow. Welcome, man. Now, listen closely. A true okay, I don't have to say anything for this. Carry the fiery soul of a Leave people giving you a follow. I appreciate it. I don't know how to raid properly. <laughs> I'm learning. It's all good. Um, You could just do exclamation point raid in your chat, and then space, and then whoever you're trying to raid's name, and then it'll automatically do it within a set amount of seconds, or then you can hit the raid now button and then it does it. 
Our school curriculum nurtures the but also hello Leona and Knox so that they contribute to society Hope you guys had a great stream oh la la how wonderful I wish to set my soul an exchange student and learn the ways of the great samurai also. yeah it's it's the way I like doing it That's what I like. especially in the beginning when you're like still trying to get used to the um the dashboard and all its buttons and all that stuff it's easier just to do that it was getting spicy hot. <laughs> yeah, my laptop does that too. It goes infernal. Huh? The library. All I have to do is like watch a YouTube video on my laptop and it will just be like Strange. absolutely on fire. Made sure to check the map, my but... brain is infernal. <laughs> That's me too. I have a spicy brain. <clears throat> Sorry, drinking. All right. Um, I do not like controlling this with mouse and keyboard. I'm gonna say that right now, but I'm too lazy still to get my controller. I cook bacon under mine for stream snacks. I mean, that's that's smart. That's multitasking. Uh, that seems to be the faculty office. Should I go in? Yeah. E3 reload. I'm trying not to buy it. Too many good games recently. Yeah. I uh, I have a um, one of those like merged accounts with somebody like the family share accounts and they have this so I'm playing this for free. You're a second year, correct? Yeah. Wow, you've lived in a lot of different places. Let's see, ten years. Yeah, and I think you would dislike me for that. I'm sorry. I've been so busy. I actually wasn't even sure what I wanted to stream today. I was debating on, you know, showing how bad I am at Rainbow Six Siege. And then I remembered I had this, access to this, and I was like, okay, fair enough. Ton of games are interesting, and I know nothing about them. They are really fun. They are really, really good. Um, thanks. Have you seen buy too many games, I work for the post office and make quite, quite a bit of my day job. 60 plus hours a week. Ah, yeah. I respect people who work for, like, the post office so much. I'll show you the way. Like I, I'm, I'm used to physically demanding jobs, but so, that stuff takes like a whole other, other thing. Like it's like as physically demanding as when I worked at like a warehouse, but then at the same time, it's like you, ha you still have the component of like customer service to it, and I hate that. <laughs> I hate that so much. The one thing that's nice about working in like manufacturing and and warehouses and stuff like that is you don't have to deal with anybody than like besides your fellow associates. Which, when you're a manager, that means less people that could talk back to you. <laughs> you must be pretty close, huh? What's the deal between you and her? I never get to play most. I never finish most. That's my issue. Boyfriend? <laughs> Nobody seems to know. Customer service is the worst. Yeah. Uh, does she have a boyfriend? I don't know. Oh really? I thought you might know, but I guess not. Dude, I just got here. Why would I know? Sorry, you guys. I say I'm Herbor. Someone's talking. Yeah, sounds like it's coming from Miss Toriyumi's class. Oh god. Hey, shh. Be quiet. You're gonna get me in trouble. Worst than customer service was industrial construction. For me, I'd rather do almost anything than customer service, because I am just um Sup, dude? How's it going? I'm good at putting on the customer service face, like but that? beneath that I have zero patience for people. And so like when you come in and you're just like being unbelievably hostile about something. What I really want to do is like jump over the desk and just or table and go for your ass. But like, <laughs> where's of like, oh, hey, yeah, I'm sorry to hear that. You know, all right, let me see what I can do for you. And I'm just like, you're a stupid, petty ass problem, man. When it's when it's sound and they come in all rational, it's just like, hey, I have a problem. It's like, oh, good. A normal person. Uh, what do you want? Oh, come on. Let me introduce myself at least. Thank you for the lurk, Prinny. Hi, Junpei. I transferred here when I was a second year in middle school. It's pretty tough being a new kid at first, you know? So I just wanted to say, hey, see what a nice guy I am? That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money to spend. But like at the same time, like if it makes you happy, go for it. But I, I cannot fathom spending that much money. Oh my god. Best friend. Try not to make him uncomfortable, okay? What? I was just being friendly. If you say God. so. Anyway, 
Who would have thought we'd be in the same homeroom? Oh, really? That's actually that's actually really good then. That's insane how much of a reduction that is. Good for you, legit. I uh, worked front and back of house at a vet clinic at the public treat vet staff like garbage. Oh yeah, I I don't I don't know I don't know what it what it is about people and just like the entitlement of being like hey I am I am better than you because you work in a service job and nine times out of ten they worked in a service job so it's like I don't understand what part of you what part of you is so sad that you have to like ruin somebody else's day I can understand being frustrated there are plenty of times I call up a customer service place or walk into a place and I'm like, I'm mad, like something something went bad, but I'm not going to sit here and attack some random ass person for a problem they didn't facilitate. And even if I, even if I know they did, it's like, I'd rather try to come to a conclusion and a solution than be like, fuck you, fuck this, you know, whatever. Or like, it's even better when they're like insanely racist and it's like, okay, well, you really, you want me to help you. You want me to help you when you just called me that, right? Like, come on, man. <laughs> it's like, dude, I'll, I'll, I'll spit in your food now, man. <laughs> I used to work for Home Depot. Oh god. So the guy got all angry at me. So I put the concrete he wanted me to load into his truck tab. We walked off, you know? That's fair. I mean that is a valid response. I remember um one of my jobs, there was actually <clears throat> a rule where if they if they present you with aggression. Um, you were allowed to actually just step away. You were allowed to do this. Your the only rule was that you would try once to defuse the situation. And so if you were like, hey, can we like not name call? Can we not whatever? Can we reel it in? Then they continued to be aggressive or racist or whatever. Then you could just be like, goodbye. Goodbye. You're someone else's problem now. Um, and then you just report that to your higher up. And then a lot of other places, they were just like, fuck it. And the person could be throwing hands with you. And you still have to be like sucking their dick. And it's like, come on, man. Uh, I called a happy dog, a drama queen, and just in front of their owner. And got in trouble for making fun of the dog. Wow. I complained to my manager and they asked me why. And I'm like, if $10 an hour, I'm not getting paid to be abused. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. That's the other thing, too. It's like, I'm not getting paid enough to care about you being like this, man. Like, I'm somebody who puts 150% into my work, man. But, like, I, I don't... I, I have things I need to do, and I'm not going to sit here arguing with somebody who is upset about something I can help them with. Like, the one thing I always tell, like, the story I always bring up is, like, summed up really shortly. There was this old guy. I used to work when I was, um, <clears throat> when I was a teenager. I worked at Walmart in the electronics. And in the electronics department, we had this old guy come back there and he wanted to find like those bar things that help you get out of um, out of the shower or the tub so you could support yourself and not slip. And I was like, oh, yeah, sir, it's up front uh, in front of medical. And I like I remember just seeing it there not long ago. And I'm like, yeah, those are those are up there. Um, and he goes, I was just there and I, I, I didn't see it. And I'm like, and he's like, and now you're telling me I got to go back over there. I'm like, that's where it is, sir. This is electronics. We have like TVs, video games printers, stuff like that. That's what's back here. We got a photo station over there. And he's like, I'm tired of going around this place, blah, 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 blah. And then, and then he called me a racial expletive. And then in the meantime, I'm just like, man, I'm about to knock, a, I'm about to knock an old man on his ass. <laughs> but then I, I saw my manager and I just kind of gave her a look like, if you do not come over here in a second, there's going to be an old man on the floor. And she came over and she like took the man away and walked him up to the front. And I presumably got the item he wanted, but I was just like, my God, like he was going insane. I was like, he was, he was, he was yelling and everybody around was just like, oh God, looking at him. <laughs> I was just like, my God. Uh, like that man was on a war path. Trying to start an argument about a, even if it wasn't in medical, even if it was like in hardware or something like that, why would it have been in electronics? Huh? It is a just metal bar that you drill into your wall. It doesn't it doesn't grab you by the by the ass and lift you up and pull you out of the tub. Oh, I'm worried. Hey, you didn't tell anyone about you know what. Ah, yeah, that's 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 valid for for people in those situations. I'm in swinging right away. I had explained to someone over the phone that that service was weren't free and they were getting mad because we wouldn't give them consultation on the house 
Ah, oh, yes, of course. What? I'm special, so I get free things, yeah. Nice. So that's the ground. All box every week for nothing. I mean, a valid. You not only initiated some some kind of hate speech to me, but you also touched me. So, uh, your ass is going down, exactly. I have to go now. There's something I need to take care of for the archery team. <laughs> if they just said something, it's like, eh, ignore them. You touched me? Alright, that's, that's that's an initiation now. <laughs> That's insane to me. People are insane to me. And people are already talking about you. Believe it or not, she's actually pretty popular. You're the man. That's why, like, I... Well, it's sometimes necessary, but I will, like, vehemently, like, fight against the idea of working in the service industry again. Or working around, like, too many people. Yo. And I always try to get positions in, like, some kind of management so that... <laughs> It also limits how many, like, idiots that I have to actually deal with. Uh, I just follow you around if you want to leave, head for the front office. Okay. Oh my god. Uh, new school year, sure, or rough. New teachers, new classmates, it is exhausting having to start every year. I mean... I suppose. Oh, you're that transfer student. You're gonna join a club or something? Uh, I'm still thinking about it. I'm comfortable around other people. Um, yeah, I, I... I don't know, I'm good good news bears, drag queen. Pseudo politician for defamation and one. Nice. Uh well club activities suck anyway. You have to socialize and be considerate for other people. I guess it's a good way to make friends. But I also just wanna enjoy high school, you know. I only joined, I think, clubs in high school. Actually no, I guess I was in I guess I was in clubs pretty early on. I was in like, it, it was called Gay Straight Alliance, which is just, you know, like, a safe space, whatever. Um, for, like, a couple years. I was president of it one year. And then my senior year, I was in, like, three things. Because that's all I basically did was just hang out with people. Uh, if you're trying to leave, you gotta go a floor down. Did you forget something? No, I just wanted to talk to you, man. God. Can I talk to my new homie? Hmm. Yeah, that's that's definitely fair. Yeah. This is my school's in. I was there, I was their token straight. <laughs> that's amazing. Are you ready to head out? Yeah, I'm good. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna look around too much. <laughs> hey, Rainbow, how you doing? We need a new straight now, right? Clubs are such a foreign concept here. Like, when I see them in media, it's like, oh yeah, those exist. Yeah. They existed, I think, at both high schools I went to. But they were definitely more prominent at the one I graduated from. It was... The one I, the one I graduated from already had a GSA. And then... The school I went to for one year, I was the founder and president of it. Everyone's excited because school's starting, but I don't really care. Things have been really weird lately. I even saw some policemen around earlier. Mm -mm. Oh, I guess a new school uh, semester started. I was wondering why I've been seeing so many students around. The world's a strange place these days. These kids better prepare themselves for the future. Yeah, it's, it's horrible. <laughs> Not that they matter at my age. Yeah, that's fair. Cat-loving boy, same. Uh, my friend has a cat, and it's so cute. I'm not allowed to have one, though, so I just try to get my fill of cats by looking at strays. I mean, that's that's the way to do it. I want to eat some takoyaki. Huh? Who are you? I'm not allowed to talk to strangers, sorry. Alright, good kid, good kid. Alright, where are we going in the dorm? Here's why we don't have clubs anymore. Yeah. They're 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 a good idea, but um I don't know. I think if I was in school now, I probably wouldn't join a club, personally. But like it was a good thing back then. I met a lot of people who were, you know, like minded. 
I formed the anime club um, my senior year, and I think that's still going at my school, so... That feels good to know. It was so small, ragtag group too, but I met like some of my like best friends there. And I got my like 62 year old teacher who was our like, I guess you could say like sponsor, like he was the one giving us a classroom and stuff. He actually ended up um, getting into anime because of the club, because we had to find a teacher who could like host the room and also of course watch all the kids. Um, and so at the time I got a, a Spanish teacher I spoke to a lot. Um, he was like, yeah, sure, whatever. Um, and he, he would be the most one interested. The rest of us would be like talking usually when we would like have anime or something in the background. And he would actually be sitting there, his desk chair turned around, like glasses on, watching whatever was playing. <laughs> uh, such a dying back in high school. I, I, I was normal. I was, I was normal teenager. I just, you know, I did what I had to do. Fucked around after classes. I wasn't really too, uh, or anything. Uh, you got the film teacher to host her anime club. That's that's pretty good right there. She got so into it. It was great. She was like 70. Yeah, he was like, yeah, he was like in his 60s or something like that. Never watched a lick of anime. And then I showed him a bunch of things. And anytime he didn't like he was really interested, he'd be like, hey, so uh, what's the name of this anime? And I'm like, oh, it's this. And I'd see him like write it down in a book. And I'm like, oh, that's so cute. And then in one, in one year he bought me, um, he was at a, a book sale, and he bought me a, um, a a book on writing kanji. And he was just like, here, you can, you know, I was at a book sale, you know, I know you're learning Japanese, here you go. Um, you know, just return it to me at the end of the year. When the end of the year came around, I was like, oh, here's your book back. Uh, thank you for letting me use it. And he goes, what are you doing? And I'm like, what do you mean, what, are you, what am I doing? And he goes, it's your book, keep it. I'm like, oh, thank you. And, he was like, and he just chuckled. He's like, you honestly thought I wanted you to give it back? I was like, uh, yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> uh, things I would have been very interested in because of maintaining my image back then. Yeah, I was, I was, um, I was always an emo kid. So image was not a, not a standard. It was, uh, fuck off, don't talk to me. That, that was my image. Yes. <laughs> And yet somehow people still wanted to talk to me, and I'm like, please. I don't think you're getting the hints. <laughs> you're not understanding that I do not want to talk. Uh, I have a long day to get some rest. Thank you. I love sleeping. Please, I'm using one hand. Oh, yeah, that's fair. That's definitely fair. Oh, hi. Uh, what are you doing? Uh, just looking around. Huh. Yeah. You're probably pretty tired after your first day, huh? Maybe you should go to bed early. And why does everyone want me to go to sleep, man? Is everything going to become coffins again? Is that what you're telling me? The answer is yes. A7 watch streak. I only know these games from the memes. What's up? I mean, that's a good place to know them from. It's a vacant room. I'm like controlling this game half with one hand because I keep drinking in between. Hey, look at these streaks, man. Also high crystal and high armors. Oh yeah, for sure, for sure. I luckily, all of my queerness was uh, able to be, able to be concealed without like trying to conceal it. I just, I'm very, I was always very, like, straight presenting, so, like, I didn't luckily have too much of an issue. I made it an issue, I guess, being president eventually of the GSA, but, uh, yeah. Pretty, uh, pretty obvious at that point. Because nobody, nobody in their right minds, who was just a, a, a like, a, a straight ally, would have been president of the GSA at that time. Maybe nowadays, sure, but... No. Mm -mm, not then. Cases of apathy syndrome are suddenly developing in people who showed no symptoms prior. It's been quite a time. Hey, let's go, Leona. Congrats. Stress, but... B3, yeah. Yeah, right. Free access to it, so I'm like, let's go. Otherwise, it's not worth my time. You have a one-track mind. Will you be okay out there on your own? Don't worry. I'm just getting a little practice. 
Yeah, it's definitely rough trying to like maintain that, especially when you're like in the closet to yourself. I mean, it's not good to in general, like even outside of like queer related issues or whatever. It's just it's just always really bad for your mental health when there's a portion of yourself that you're just like completely burying for whatever reason, parents or society or whatever. Uh, I can hear people talking. I heard the rumor about uh, what was it again? The bathroom? The old news. Besides, it's just a ghost story, not a rumor. You're talking about that one girl, right? The second year? She stopped coming to school and just sits around staring at walls all day. Whenever her mom tries to talk to her, the only thing she says is, It's coming. It's coming. What? Is that really how the story goes? Eh, whatever. It's probably all made up anyway. Some disturbing rumors seem to be spreading around the school. Oh, Hifumi is my name. Oh, Hifumi. Hmm, 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 hmm. It's nobody acting to make any stand on this. Ah, fair, fair, fair. You got added. Uh, his essays are fantastic, and he's also a famous haiku. Uh, I wonder why all of this isn't in the textbook. Well, I guess I'll just bring in his book home next time. Yeah. Speaking of haiku, they often use words or phrases related to seasons, but it's easy to get them mixed up. For example, you'd think tasty bamboo shoots and vivid carp streamers uh, would symbolize spring, right? Well, they're actually related to summer. Haiku poets usually refer to seasons based on the lunar calendar, making it fairly complicated. Hey, Iori, are you listening? Here's a question for you. One sec. One sec, one sec. I'm getting pinged a lot in somewhere. <laughs> one sec. <laughs> I was getting annoyed. I need to turn off these notifications. Oh my god. I hope everyone's really cozy from... Uh, all of this okay i am at immune i don't know how but i am <laughs> magic i mean it's that's a weird thing right sometimes um sometimes i don't get ads watching people they'll be like everyone will be like ads and i don't get them but i'm not subbed or i'm not with a turbo so i don't know uh what have i missed uh everyone died the world died uh, I'm gonna be good and not spend money for a few weeks. Bad financial decisions lately. I, I get that. Because my laptop is about to burn into oblivion, so I'm off. I appreciate it. Thank you, Nox. Have a good one. Did I hear someone say Lunar New Year? Yes. Uh, social stats. When you're going about your day-to-day -day life, you will come across certain actions that require the use of one of these traits. Academics, charm, and courage. Social stats can be raised by doing various things around the city or by answering questions correctly in class. Keep an eye out for activities that might help you hone these skills. I don't know how I'm gonna build right now. Like I, I could I could be that sweaty min maxer who's like, oh I gotta get like all the social links up. I gotta get like every single like thing correct. I don't know. I might just like go with the vibe. A phrase symbolizes summer. Uh vivid farp streamers. Exactly. Yep. Why are you excited about the Lunar Year? <laughs> Mercy. The sculptural things. Uh, by the way, mystical mirage and a rain of flowers represent spring. Mirage is a natural phenomenon that occurs around late March to early June. And a rain of flowers refers to the spring showers around the time cherry blossoms bloom. It's not literally raining flowers. Make sure you remember all that. Our next topic is... You know how much I like to pay attention. Man, you seriously saved my bacon, Ifumi. Uh, Sabakun ga uh, gave him the answer just now. He must have a good memory or something. I can hear my classmates whispering. Stat increase? I've become slightly more popular. Yeah! <laughs> I show I have a brain cell. Woo! Thank you for the lurk, Leona. Have a good sleep as well. It's a Saturday. Yes, yes it is. Eat noodles Saturday for longevity? Yes, absolutely. I plan on getting some lo mein. Or making it. I don't know. We'll see how it, um, how motivated I feel. Although I'm sure I, I'm probably going to like schedule it to be ordered ahead of time. Because if I don't, um, it's going to be a pain in the ass. Because I'm sure everybody's going to have like a similar idea. Mm, mm. Sleepy, sleepy. 
charm should be changed to what's <laughs> far <laughs> absolutely uh the strip mall is bustling with activity in the afternoon damn right congrats on the brain cell thank you thank you it comes and goes but right now it is intact my attention span not so much but my brain cell is actually functioning a little bit today good evening my name is shuji ikutsuki i'm the chairman of the board for your school Thank you. Hard to say, isn't it? That's why Not really. I don't like introducing myself. Even I get tongue tied sometimes. Please have a seat. For the confusion regarding your accommodations, but it may take a bit longer before you receive. The Is there anything you'd like to ask? Didn't mean to skip that. Um, why are you here? To welcome you, of course. You don't mind, do you? Speaking of which, Takebakun, have you seen? I can't wait till hear the battle theme. I'm so ready. She's upstairs. As diligent as always, but it couldn't hurt to come down and say hello. Is there anything else? Um. No, I'm good. Excellent. Here's to a wonderful school year. Now, if you'll excuse me. I'm sure you're worn out from all these formalities. You may want to consider going to bed early, as they say. <laughs> I just, <laughs> I just love the idea of just like being in this situation, and they're all just like, "Go to bed early, go to bed, go to sleep, go." I'm just like, Jesus, man, why do, I, <laughs> why do you want me to sleep so bad? <laughs> I'd be like, this is so sus that everybody here just wants me to sleep. P3 music will always be a banger. Yo, Persona knocks out of the park with all the music. And every every single one of the games has their own like identity to the music too. Like you can tell like, oh, that's Persona 4 music or that's P3 or whatever. So I just listen to them and go rest in my room. I also like that they keep getting like the recurring uh Hello there. artists. So, how's he doing? He went to bed a little while ago. He's currently fast asleep. Mr. Chairman. Why do you need to have such big speakers attached to this apparatus? Well, let's wait and see for now. The dark hour is approaching. Come on, what do you say? I can't leave a girl standing around. I mean, I'm cool, but if my parents found out, you don't need to know. Just drop them a text. It'll be fine. Yeah. Okay, let's do it. Ugh, it sucks. I'm just here jamming while these cutscenes are happening. Well, there. It's coffin time, baby. Quite literally. What the? And I'd just be like, damn, I don't know what I ate. That's crazy. What's happening to me? <laughs> That's fair. I mean, unless it's a new theme, I'm aware of it already. I don't know how much they've changed, like, the music or themes of this game at all. ...occurs every day at 12 midnight. You could say it's the hidden hour. But it is still good for other people not to, uh, say it if it's too big of a spoiler anyways. ...and is oblivious to all that occurs. That's why I won't say anything. <laughs> As you can see, he's retained his human form. He may be asleep, but he's definitely experiencing the dark hour. The only question that remains is whether or not he has the potential. Though, come to think of it, the potential he must. If he didn't, they would have preyed on him by now. Scary. In any case, we should continue to monitor him for a few more days. Yes, sir. I've been meaning to replay this game too, so then I was like, the moment that they were like, Hey, it's a 
getting like a, a like a remake thing. I was like, oh fuck yeah, that's a definite excuse to replay it then, because I was just gonna play a portable, but yeah. Also wanted to play uh, P4 Golden again. To the Velvet Room. Hi, Igor. My name is Igor. I know. I am delighted to make your acquaintance. This is Elizabeth. She's a resident here, like myself. My favorite of the attendants. Please, to meet you. Hi. This place exists between dream and reality, mind and matter. I think I, I think I also prefer the um the limousine version of this room. Oh, an elevator is pretty metal. That's the document I signed at the dorm. From now on, you shall be welcome here as a guest in the Velvet Room. You were destined to hone your unique ability, and you will require my assistance to do so. I only ask one thing. In return, abide by your contract and assume full responsibility for the choices you make. Sure. Hold on to this. Velvet key. Until we meet again. Goodbye, Mosquito Man. I don't know if I'm gonna. Mm, I don't know if I'm gonna do any fusions this round. I don't know. I don't really care about the fusions. I just end up mostly using my main persona, anyways. Uh, it feels like I had a strange dream. Uh, it's time to go to school. Okay. Oh, good. I didn't have to walk here. I'm so sleepy today. In times like these, the best course of action is to sleep during class. Me. Um, the adrenaline rush you get from dozing off right in front of your teacher can really spice up your dreams. Yeah, it gives me the courage trait. Um, I know what you mean. Do I care enough to sleep in class? I don't know. Yeah, it's real addicting, and then after you build up the courage to do it once, you gotta try it again. And again, because I'm not listening to lecture, I'm pretty much screwed later. Oh, but we have classic literature today, that means we're stuck with a Mr. Nasty Old Ekuda. Um... I forget what the benefit... Well, I know that you get courage from, uh, sleeping, but... I forget if there is a detriment to that. Um, I'll be your classic literature teacher. Well, I'll be hearing all about old Japan through some great stories. Exciting, right? Now, some people say classic lit isn't relevant anymore, but oh, are they wrong? The students, uh, the other teachers, they don't know. I hate this man so much. They don't know what they're talking about. Nobody really understands it like they should. The moment I saw his face, I was like, oh, fuck. I'm feeling sleepy. <laughs> Should I close my eyes for a few minutes? Uh, do I care? I don't know. Yeah, I guess. I guess I'll, I'll, I'll appeal to the tutorial and I'll, I'll get that courage. I can feel the glare as I'm dozing off. It's like my courage is being tested. Hey. Mm-mm. After school. Somewhere on the way home. Uh, where? I don't know. Maybe grab a bite to eat. And you said food, yes. I would not turn down food, even if I still had to pay for it. It's like, you want to get food? I'd be like, yes. Yes, please. This is Colonial Mall. Whenever I hang out with the guys from school, we end up coming here. There's a karaoke box, an arcade. Oh, yeah, you can rent out CDs too. And there's that club over there. Not that I've ever done it myself. This place may not look like much, but I'm not complaining. Let's check out the CDs first. I gotta try this. Let me show you my mad crane game speed. Yeah, go ahead. Damn it! Got some mad skills, man. Yeah, that's it. Yo. 
crane games in the in the, in the hunts right there. I hung out with Junpei for a while before heading back to the dorm. But what about the food? Did I just stand there watching him uh, fail at a crane game for that long? Welcome back. Pretty late. I don't mean to be overbearing, but please don't make this a regular occurrence. Yes, mother. In any case, you look quite tired. <laughs> why don't you head to bed? Yo, I would be like, all right, all right, why is everybody telling me to keep going to bed early? Like, you said it, the old man said it, you know, freaking... <laughs> you caught he said it. It's like, why, why are all of you saying this, please? I'd be like, what the fuck is happening? What am I missing? I, I would deliberately be up that night. I'd be like, all right. Okay, when it's displayed, you can open the town menu for there. Some shortcut decimations, or even the shortcut function itself may be unavailable in certain situations. By the way. I guess there was a dorm mother here once who cooked and stuff, but it's just us students now. Maybe that's why we have such a nice kitchen. It seems like a waste not to use it. Yeah, it does. I think... Yeah, I don't know that I'd really be able to make good use of it, though. Um, and Kirijo Senpai doesn't do stuff like cooking, um, but I would feel kind of bad if no one ever used it. I will become the master chef here, you know? Oh, right. I must say, the moon looks quite stunning on these hazy spring nights. Uh, the tempting as it may be to spend a night uh, such as this staring at the sky, I suggest you head to bed early and get some rest. I'd be like, woman, well, please. Uh, don't worry, there will be more full moons. I, hi, hi, how, are you gonna, how are you gonna sit here and just be like, damn, this is not weird at all. Can I go in here? I can. Oh, I can go in the bathroom. I know that. I can feel my mind starting to wander as I wash my hands. Whenever I see cherry blossoms in full bloom, it feels like springtime has finally arrived. It's a random... Random thoughts I have, my guy. I know this isn't, like, the version of the game that... has the female protagonist, but I'm surprised that they didn't actually give the option of that. They wanted to have the actual, like, pure... experience, I guess. Can I watch TV? Yeah. Okay. Sleep, sleep. I feel like I'd be getting brainwashed. Everybody's just being like, you, you want to go to bed early? Like, everyone's just <laughs> inserting the thought. I feel exhausted. Maybe it's because I haven't gotten used to living here. Uh, just who was that old man from the dream I had last night? What was that contract all about? I mean, it clearly wasn't a dream if you physically, tangibly have a key. I mean, I guess it technically still would have been a dream, but... Just... One that is actually... Real, I guess? I don't know how to describe that. How is he? Looks like he's a little worn out. He went to bed without changing out of his uniform. Other than that, nothing has changed since last night. Hmm. Very interesting. Even those who have the potential tend to be unstable at first. Memory loss, disorientation. This subject is rather unique. He has an I have the power of apathy. Symptoms. Nothing is phasing me. But we're treating him like a guinea pig. Oh, don't look at it like that. The two of you are classmates, right? Consider it an opportunity to have someone your own age here. Besides, we need all the help we can get. I guess that's true, but still. Command room speaking. Akihiko, what's wrong? <clears throat> You're not gonna believe it. This thing is huge. I don't think you should be listening to what's happening. It's chasing after me right now. I'm almost back. This sounds like a very personal time, though. Advance. Be broadcasting. Does that mean he's bringing that thing here? Mr. Chairman. That's enough observation for now. We need to prepare for combat. Uh, right. Be careful. I'm all right. Get ready to be surprised. It'll be here any second. This is no time to joke around. <laughs> is it one of them, Sanada Kun? Yeah, but not an ordinary one. Ah, what was that? You've got to be kidding me. Mr. Can I go outside before it brings the building down. Talk about. Go upstairs 
and wake him up. Then escape out the back. But what about you two? We'll stop it here. You're the one who led it to us, Akihiko. So I'm going to have you fight. It's not like I asked it to follow me. What are you waiting for, Takeba? Go! Uh, okay! <laughs> yeah, he's a great voice actor. I should, go, I should check what's happening outside. Mm, good sound design. There's no time to explain. We have to get out of here now. Oh, what's going on? Hurry to the first floor. We'll leave through the back. Oh, wait. Take this just in case. <laughs> just <laughs> I'd like to imagine, right? How unfazed this character is. Weird shit's happening all the time. Girl comes into your room at some weird hour of the night after an earthquake and just hands you a short sword. <laughs> um, <laughs> she has a gun, I have a short sword. <laughs> it's the funniest part of Persona, man. Like a bunch of kids getting a bunch of weapons and then going into a TV. In it, in the middle of an electronic store. We have to get to safety, okay. Hey. Oh, but I want to fight. Yeah. Hey. I will go wherever I want. You <sighs> need to calm down. It's gonna be okay. Getting to safety is our priority now. I don't play this game at all in English, so like, I legit do not know like any of like I, I've heard the English VAs, but not enough to be like, um, not enough to be like uh, super familiar with them. I just know certain famous like anime VAs are in it. That's true. That is true. Then you'd be on the other rooftop, you know? <sighs> I've locked the door, so we should be safe for now. Why would locking the door stop what's about to happen? P3 is so much creepier than 4 and 5. You can't sleep flavor. I get that. Sorry to hear that though. That's it. One of the monsters that attacked us. Shadow. You're not gonna be able to do it. You won't. Yep. I get to shine here. Literally does not care about me. Hello, Cure. You have a calming voice. <laughs> I appreciate that. It's Hopefully, it helps you sleep. Wait. <sighs> Voices in my head telling me to shoot myself with this. Persona. What is this? Persona. I am thou. Thou art I. From the sea of thy soul, I come. I. Hello. What is this? 
Master of Strength. I like Orpheus so much more than uh, Izanagi. Just as we thought. Oh no, but um, the other one. Uh, thank you for the wellness uh, check in general. I ate. Actually, it's been a while. It's been a while since I ate. Uh, it has been a while since I ate. But thank you for the snacky and the hydrate and the head pads and all the things. Ugh. Hell yeah. Thank you, thank you. I got some nice, um, cherry, uh, Pepsi Zero. Very nice. And some pretzels. Thank you. Yeah, see, you could be doing this, but you're not. <laughs> that is true. It's up to chat to make sure I don't totally die. Especially on the eating department, like the actual food, like eating an actual meal. Should re add um, that treat stream thing to my. Uh, about area so people could just be like yo i'll get you a burger because you haven't eaten i need to add some restaurants that are open late though to that list because most of them that are on there are like they close at like around the time that i start streaming unless somebody like gets food like right at the start of stream it's just not gonna happen I need to protect her. Oh, there it is. Bye 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 bye. Those shadows. Did they break off from that other one? <laughs> mm -mm 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 -mm. I love gold. Let's go. Gone. See, you could have done this. And you know what you're doing. Monsters are gone. Good night. Are you okay? Oh, come on. Can you hear me? <laughs> I mean, I know how to cook, but, uh, but you know. I just don't wanna. I, and the thing is, is, I like cooking too. It's so good. Even incredibly complicated dishes and stuff, but it's just um. After awakening to your... Last thing I want to be doing is cooking at midnight. Ooh. I see that it was Orpheus who heated your call. Even though this would technically be like my like, or or five p.m. essentially, with how my sleeping is, but. Of your psyche. Uh, persona. Persona is a facet of your personality that surfaces as you react to external stimuli. You can think of it as a mask that protects you as Quite you literally in another game. Hardships. A mask? The power of a persona is the power of one's soul. And the soul is You gonna need some eye drops, man. The one's bond. As you form these bonds by becoming involved with others, your own social... Oh yeah, that's that's definitely a good thing. The strength of these I've gotten pretty good at managing the portions that I cook. The only time I tend to make, like, too much, it's not usually, like... At this point, it's not that I, I accidentally do it, it's just kind of like, yeah, whatever, it works. It's when I make, like, spaghetti, or, like, fried rice, or... Meatloafs, um, I don't think what else. That's usually it. Everything else I'm pretty good at portion controlling. That or I just eat it all. 
like when I make those tomes and stuff like that, I'll just have like I'll just make like a lot. I'll just have a whole plate like stacked high, and I'll eat like half of it. <laughs> uh, my head is getting clearer. I can feel someone's presence beside me. You're awake. How do you feel? Like I shot myself in head in the head with a magical gun. Thank goodness you finally woke up. Oh, this is Tatsumi Memorial Hospital. It's just a short walk from the station. The doctor couldn't find anything wrong. He said you were just exhausted. Yeah, it's definitely a love language for me too. I, I absolutely love having guests over and cooking for them. Wow, that power of yours was really something. Uh, what were those things? You mean the shadows? They're what we're fighting against. And that power you used, we call it Persona. Don't worry, we'll explain everything later. I'm sorry I didn't tell you before. I, uh... I wanted to tell you something. I can kind of relate. To you, I mean. Uh, what do you mean? My dad died in an accident when I was little. And my mom and I aren't exactly on good terms. You're all alone too, aren't you? To be honest, I already heard about your past. But it didn't seem fair, so I wanted you to know about mine, too. This was a while ago, but there was a big explosion in the area. Supposedly, my dad died in the blast, but nobody really knows what happened. Oh, that's fair. I don't really bake. That's a thing for me. I don't bake. I only cook. Then again, I'm very much that cook that is very improvisational and i know like Not that I was much what to put into things without needing to actually look at recipes or measurements and baking is by no means that it is a it is a precise art and so therefore my chaotic nature of just being like you know what this needs a little bit of this is not not a good thing i mean i guess if i baked enough it would become a combination of both because then you know what you can and can't do to the to the baked good before it you know destabilizes or whatever but I, I don't like baking. I leave that to usually whoever I'm with. I always seem to live with somebody who's a baker, so... Like, between all like all of my roommates that I've had in apartments and stuff, they're always a baker, so I, I cook, they bake. It's also nice, because then I don't have to do the second part. And sometimes we'll swap, right? They'll bake something that is the, the entree, and then I'll cook something that's a dessert. I'll let the others know you're okay. They said you could leave once you regain consciousness, so I think you're free to go home. See you. There's lots of lots of good desserts that also do not require baking that you can do on the stove top or do cold or whatever. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Uh, welcome back. I gotta say, I'm so relieved now that you're out of the hospital. Uh, don't push yourself though. Do you want to get some rest? Don't worry, your room's safe now. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh yeah, we haven't saved in like two years. It's literally been since yeah, it's been <laughs> it's been like sixty minutes. Uh, Kita doesn't have. I said she'll be late today. I guess she's processing some paperwork for you. Hey, try not to overdo it at school tomorrow. Are you telling me to sleep in class? I bake. <laughs> I bake all fives at this point. I mean, fair. I would love to. I mean, I, I like doing a lot of the stuff I can for myself, just like on my own. Like between cooking, making desserts, making my own beverages and stuff like that is all really relaxing and nice. And then it feels good to be like, I know what went into this, right? I made this, I know what's in it, I know what's not in it. Compared to being like, oh yeah, let, let me drink this, uh, this, this milk over here or something, you know, and it's like, ah, oh, it's got so much sugar in it or something. I should rest for today. My favorite is making the sourdough or NSF dumplings. Uh, oh, okay, fair enough. I haven't made dumplings in, I don't know. It's been like two years, I think. I should. I've been wanting to make ramen from scratch again, but it's been, that's been even longer. That's been like four years, four or five years since I've made ramen. It's a whole it's a whole thing to to make the dough and then make the noodles and it's like ah uh, I'm just too lazy now. I've become so lazy. Just someone's full of energy today. I could hear you from all the way over there. 
Huh? You two didn't come to school together, even though you're in the same dorm? Are you stupid or something? I've heard enough about that. Anyway, Sawakun, are you feeling better? Sorry to hit you with this so soon after you've recovered, but the chairman wants to talk to you today. Head to the dorm after school and come to the fourth floor. Don't forget, okay? What? Hold up. Why are you being so called out by the ch the chairman? What the heck did you do? It's not like that. Something serious. Come on. We're going to be late if we stand just stand around here talking. Hmm. Can we call it a day? Imagine being this guy. Uh, that's enough about mammoths. I don't see the big deal. They're just huge elephants. You're the one teaching us, man. Worst part about the dumplings is if they're... Uh... Uh, yeah, that's fair. I'd rather talk about the Sengoku uh, era. Japanese history is not exciting enough until then. Is it? I, I mean, I guess that is that. I guess that is a a point when it gets a bit more interesting. Uh, but it's what I'm paid to do, so here we are. It's not easy. Uh, next is the Jomon period. When do the samurai get their day in the sun? Oh, you're asking me? That's crazy. Uh, dump their waste in the jungle. What are they called nowadays? Uh, they're called uh, middens. Middens. Uh, we're Scandinavian origin and means dunghill. That didn't work. Still not interested in this at all. <laughs> I want to get to the age of katanas. Yeah, that's when it's that's when it's really good, man. Lots of, lots of good drama. So the moment Samurai gets introduced, the drama. That's what's fun about that portion of Japanese history. There's so much, like, uh, fun fun things that happen between different groups. I mean, not really fun in the moment, but <laughs> fun to learn about. <laughs> that's why I'm super excited for that new show that's coming out. I think it's called Shogun. Which I'm hoping it's really good, and I'm hoping it's not just, like, incredibly campy. But I'm hoping there's a lot of good, like, um, political stuff, I guess, in it. Uh, sure. We live in the same dorm and all, and I've been a little worried. What I mean, it's not that it's not interesting, but I definitely agree that, like, it's a lot more interesting once, um, Let me make it up to you. things get, like, you know, <laughs> as, as bad as it is to say, more warlike. Mm-mm. I'm glad you're feeling okay now. Well, I guess I'll head up first. But I, I also just like, like world I cultures and, and history and stuff in general. Chairman. I used to be like I mean I guess it still is a big hobby of just like researching and studying everything from um like political things to war history to um religious beliefs to Mythology, all that stuff. I enjoy studying about different world cultures. And I have since I was a really young teenager. I haven't seen any, anything like this before. I should hold on to it full now. Okay. Let me actually save now. Get into the habit of saving since I have not been. My stuff is back to inside. I see my normal face reflected in the mirror. Oh, I'm not tired this time. The fridge seems broken. I should use the one in the lounge. Get it fixed, man. Desk is organized. Nothing good on. Ah, fair, fair, fair. Yeah, I don't, I don't have any actual academic uh, history with them. Um, like world studies and cultures and stuff. That's just a that's a hobby. I do that on my own time. Besides whatever was required of me to take, which was very limited and specific things, like very basic, like I don't know. It's very very much touches the surface, I guess. And so I always wanted to deep dive on my own time. I'm glad to see that. I also always like studying space and um that's why I asked you to see me some other scientific things, I guess. Please. Have a seat. I'm a well of, I guess, useless knowledge. Oh, 
but it's not applicable to me. I I mentioned his name before. But it's just cool things to know. Hey there. Hi. Okay. Let me start off by asking you this. Would you believe me if I said that it's a thing of more than 24 hours? <laughs> that's good, that's good. Yeah, I like I like reasonable reaction. I always like that kind of stuff. Go ahead and nerd out and like when I play with my friends on like games like Smite and stuff, I love nerding out and just talking about like the mythology of the gods and heroes and monsters that are in that game. And if there's parallels to history, like with Daji and stuff like that, then it's like, you know. I mean a lot of the a lot of the Chinese quote unquote gods and uh, fantastical heroes and stuff were actually political figures. Well, not political figures, but historical figures, that's the word. Just over fantasized because of the feats that they achieved, but. And so it's really nice to be like. And it occurs each night and midnight. talking about those things and then i feel like a nerd and i'm like all right i'll stop <laughs> i'll stop <laughs> people don't realize it since they're all sleeping inside their coffins but that's not what makes the i'm like you're just trying to play a game where you're shooting abilities at other other gods and stuff like you don't you don't need me sitting here we call them shadows they only appear during the dark hour <laughs> that's a good thing though it's good to be passionate about something like that our job to defeat them pretty exciting huh Akihiko, why are you always like this? You just got hurt the other day. Now, now, he does his work well in any case. I'll get to the point. We are the specialized extracurricular SES squad. C's for short. On paper, we're classified as a school club. But in reality, this group is dedicated to defeating the shadows. Mitsuru Kirijokun is the leader. And I'm the club advisor. A shadow feeds on the mind of its prey. The victim becomes a living corpse. Also me, gotcha. Syndrome. Yeah. Sure you've heard of yep, it. got that. We sometimes refer to those who suffer from this as the lost. Mm -mm, okay. <laughs> They're responsible for most of the incidents on the news. You're gonna try to sleep again? Alright. Hopefully, hopefully it sticks this time. Have a good sleep. How do you fight them? Although rare, there are those who can function during the dark hour. Some may even awaken to a power that enables them to fight shadows. That's known as persona. persona. The power you called upon the other night. Shadows can only be defeated by persona users. That means you are the only ones who stand a chance against them. I see. I'm glad you're quick to understand. What he's trying to say is, we want you to join us. We've prepared an evoker for you. We'd like you to lend us your strength. Uh, all right. Yep, sure. Whatever. I'm just like, here for the ride. <laughs> I was afraid you'd say no. I'm glad to hear you're on board. Thank you so much. Truly. Oh, I almost forgot. About your room assignment. Why don't you just stay in the room you have now? I don't know what the holdup is, but I guess it worked out in the end. <laughs> Hold up, but wasn't that? Oh, never mind. <laughs> Join sees to fight the shadows. I can hear a voice ring inside my head. Oh, oh, oh. The fool. My tarot. We love the tarot. Rank up. Joined. Uh -huh. Achievement for that. Joining SES. I recall what Igor said about the power of social links. That's all for today. I'll follow up with you regarding our club activities later on. Uh, certain terms that have been displayed before in the messages along with their descriptions can be viewed by opening the menu with tab, going to system, and selecting dictionary. I apologize for gathering you all here on your precious day off. Hmm. Sunday, so take some time to relax. Oh yeah. 
Shall we end this meeting? Ah. Uh. <laughs> you know, because it's the weekend. Shall we end? Shall we end? Get okay. it? Okay. you please. <laughs> I, I, I sigh, but I make like jokes like that too sometimes, so you know. <laughs> and you are? We've met before. Aware of that. Soon, the end will come. I remembered, so I thought I should tell you. The end? It's the end of everything, but to be honest, I don't really know much about it. Oh, I know what I'm gonna eat after stream now. I know what I'm gonna eat. I'm gonna fry up, fry up some like corned beef hash. Make some fries, right? Some home fries. Put some cheese on there. Just absolutely fatty ass food, but like. <laughs> just came to my head. <laughs> it's like a million calories, but it's okay. I'm always watching you, even if you forget about me. Okay then. I can have a nice little cheat meal. My normal food, I guess. Regret it when I'm in a food coma. Two thousand nine, man. Hey, you in there? I remember what I was doing in two thousand nine. Looks like I slept till nighttime. Okay, he's here. So what's this about? Thanks for coming. There's someone I want to introduce. Hey, hurry up. He's just a sec. Yeah, it's just like heavy. Well, Why are you here? So Don't tell me. This is Junpei Yori from Class 2F. He'll be staying here from now on. <laughs> What's up? He's staying here? Are you sure there wasn't some mistake? I bumped into him the other night. He has the potential, but he just awakened to it recently. I told him about us, and he agreed to help out. Really? You have the potential? He found me crying like a baby at the convenience store, surrounded by a bunch of coffins. I don't remember much, but man, that's embarrassing. But he said that's, you know, completely normal in the beginning. Like being confused and not remembering anything. You guys know that? Uh-huh. Oh, right. Of course. Makes sense, since your persona is there and all. But man... I still can't believe it. I had no idea you guys had this stuff going on, too. <laughs> the, the uh, extracurricular activities, you know? Really of the supernatural kind. You gotta be stoked, too, right? Having me join? Absolutely. Uh, I guess. Well, enough of the introductions. Now that our forces have increased, I think we're about ready. Ooh, we gotta go do something? Sweetness! I'm getting pumped! With this many people, we could start checking out that tower. Oh, you mean Tartarus. Tartar sauce? What? Tartar sauce? It's a place that holds the key to understanding the Dark Hour. Or so we think. And the key. Oops. Everyone else have the audio would stop. The will give us more details tomorrow night, so be ready. Monday. Yeah. You ready to kick some ass? I'm so glad I was invited to join. Plus, the dorm's pretty cozy. The best part is that we're the only ones who can fight these shad or er, enemies. You seem pretty gung-ho. Right. Well, duh. Who would have been stoked about fighting for justice? Though, to be perfectly honest, I ain't got a single clue what we're supposed to be doing. But I'm sure we'll find out. They did say that they'll explain everything. Yee. 
Lunch time, food time, yeah. What is with the guys on the fourth floor? I have something to tell you all. Just talk to me anywhere, man. Oh, are we having that talk already? There's literally only <laughs> I'll save It's only us in that dorm, man. See you there. Damn. Don't waste any time. She's not like us. She's busy, you know, with the student council or whatever. Oh, Yucatan, do I sense some hostility? It's not that I don't like her, it's just... Uh, I don't know. You okay, school days finally over. You're probably waiting for I think one of my favorite things about the Persona series is just like the way that it's stylized. It's really nice and refreshing. It's like... JRPGs in general are not really that stylized when it comes to their like UIs and stuff. They'll have like very simple, incredibly blocky, and like no personality to them. Like you don't like see the menu and go, ah, oh, yeah, that RPG, right? But like you know, you see you see a UI like this, even if you don't know like, even if you haven't played the game, but you just know about the persona aesthetic, you're like, yeah, I know what this is. Mm, 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 mm. Oh man, I'm getting kind of hungry. Same. It's small rocks. So many places to chow down. Plus, they're open late. Speaking of, I heard the ramen joint upstairs has a secret late night menu. Oh, we better. As much as I would love a nice big juicy burger, we got a meeting to go to. All right, everyone's here. Heck yeah! Let's get right into it. Now, I'd like your undivided attention. For a long time, Kirijokun and Sanada-kun were the only Persona users we had, but that number has recently jumped to five. So here's the plan: starting tonight at 12 a.m. I'd like us to finally begin exploring Tartarus. Uh, so, I asked this yesterday, but what is that Tartar thing again? It's Tartarus. You seriously haven't seen it, Junpei? Uh, I mean... It's no surprise you haven't seen it. Tartarus only appears during the dark hour, after all. Only during the dark hour? Just like the shadows. Interesting, huh? The goal of our club, Seas, is to fight those shadows. However, simply defeating shadows during the dark hour isn't enough. We must get to the root of the problem. We need to destroy the dark hour itself. Uh, nah, I don't really get it. Well, you're saying if we run around Tartarus, we can somehow get rid of the dark hour? We don't know for certain. Sorry I can't give you a better answer. But investigating the mysteries of that tower is part of our job. The bottom line is, we need more information. Everything we encounter there will be a vital clue for us. The exploration of Tartarus is of utmost importance. Consider it our top priority. Our society, while remaining blissfully unaware of the shadows, slowly but surely succumbing to their influence. I would go as far as to say that the fate of the world rests on the shoulders of you Persona users. Ah, the rest on the shoulders of five teenagers. But the heroes of justice will prevail. It's also the perfect spot for us to train and improve our skills. That place is like a nest of shadows, you know. Whoa, your nest, huh? But Senpai, what about your injury? Akihiko's still recovering from his wounds. He'll accompany us, but won't participate in the exploration. <sighs> yeah, I know. <laughs> Relax! Oh, Junpei's got your backs. I'm not so sure about this. 
What about you, Mr. Chairman? I'll stay here. Not much point, anyway, since I can't summon a persona. Huh? We're here? Uh, what's going on? Why are we at school? Just wait and see. It's almost midnight. The super secret hour. It's interesting how this game has like three different styles of cutscenes. Because you have like the super shaded kind of game graphics, the normal game graphics, and then the, <laughs> the anime ones. I don't remember if it was three in the original. I thought it was only two styles. I don't know, maybe I'm wrong. Tension music. This is Tartarus, the labyrinth that reveals itself during the dark hour. Labyrinth? What are you talking about? What happened to our school? Once the dark hour passes, everything will return to normal. This is the nest you were talking about? But why? Why'd our school turn into a giant tower? So that's a that's a valid reaction to all of this. Meanwhile, my character was like, "Yeah, that's weird. No. <laughs> that's crazy. Complicated. These girls have guns for some reason. We that's weird. We'll just have to She's handing me a short sword. That's weird." There's a ghost child that no one else saw. Exciting. Weird. There's gotta be something in there. Hopefully, some sort of clue about the dark hour. Akihiko, I respect your enthusiasm, but you won't be exploring it today. I know. You don't have to keep reminding me. So this is Sartorus. In any case, we decide to enter the tower. It's our hub! Whoa. It's just as crazy on the inside. Sure is creepy, though. This is only the entrance. The labyrinth lies beyond the doorway at the top of these stairs. First, you need to get a feel for the place. Why don't the three of you go have a look around? What? By ourselves? We're not asking you to go very far. I'll help you navigate by feeding you information from here. We'll also need to appoint a leader to make any necessary decisions. Ah, I wonder who that's gonna be. A leader? Like, the captain of a pirate ship? I'm in! Me, me, me! Pick me! You're in charge. Thank you. Wait! Why him? He doesn't look like a captain! Calm down. He has experience fighting already. Wait, seriously? Yeah, I'm a badass. That's true too, but the main reason is far more simple. Junpei, and you too, Takeba. Can either of you summon your persona without difficulty like he can? Yeah, of course I can. Me too. These are shadows we're talking about. Without your persona, you're screwed. I'm aware of that. All right, let's head inside. You said head, get it, because gun to head, uh-huh. It's not, that's not why, but... Ed Mealy was my thought. <laughs> that's the spirit. The velvet key is shining in my What's eyes. The I'm just gonna excuse me while I walk away and disappear into oblivion real quick. Be right back. I've been waiting for you. The time has come for you to wield your power. The tower that you are about to venture into. How did it come to be? For what purpose does it exist? Regrettably, you are not yet capable of answering these questions. 
That is why mm -hmm. you must be made aware of something before you go any further. You must understand the nature of your power. The nature of my power? Your power is unique. It is like the number zero. Empty. But at the same time, holding infinite possibilities. You, my boy, are able to possess multiple personas and summon them at will. And when you have defeated your enemies, you will see the faces of possibility before you. There may be times when they are difficult to grasp, but do not fear. Seize what you have earned. Your power mm -hmm. will grow accordingly. Be sure to keep that in mind. Now then, my spare time will soon be scarce. Next time, once again, May you open the door and come here of your own accord. I'll tell you then about my true role. The manner in which I can best assist you. Making me stronger. That's how. Farewell. Goodbye. Okay, sorry. I'm back from the void. What's up, guys? Hey, are you alright? Yeah, what's up? Look like a zombie. Nothing. You don't need to know. Don't tell me you dozed off. You're like that coach who fell asleep during the championship game. Come on, man. You're supposed to be our leader. Uh, they don't seem to see the door. Cut him some slack. If nothing's wrong, then let's get going. Everything's perfectly fine. Everything is die, Joe Boo. Leader. Entrance to the labyrinth is at the top of the stairs. Whenever you feel ready to start, lead the way. Utilizing the menu. You can open the menu by pressing tab. Accessing the menu will allow you to view you and your allies' statuses and personas, as well as the skills and items. While exploring, while exploring Tartarus, you can save at locations where you can change your party. However, you cannot save on the floor you're currently exploring. You can save from the menu or by pressing H. Speaking of which, it has been 20 minutes of that. The large clock. It doesn't seem to be working, though. Hmm. Oh, this is Tartarus. Hell yeah! All right, let's do this. I'll prove that I should be in charge. <laughs> Remember, Takiba and Junpei have no real battle experience, so make sure you back them up. Hmm. Don't worry, I won't push you too hard. It'll be just fine. What is this? I've never seen something like this before. Regardless, it doesn't seem to func be functioning right now. Oh, look at that menu. Look how sexy that menu is. Look at that. Mmm. That is so nice. Orpheus. So, so nice. That's such a nice... Such nice menus, man. I love Persona so much. Oh, that one's... This one's really cool. I like this one. Oh, that's really cool. I love that so much. So much. So good. So good. Let's go, guys. Let's go die horribly. All right. Are you ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Let's go. Good luck. Mm -mm. And the walls will rain red slime instead of green slime. So, it's the real deal from here on, huh? Hmm. Well, it's easy to get lost in. I don't know how far I should go in the first day. I, th I think I'll take it. I'll take it easy. I think you can keep going. I don't think I'm restricted to just the first floor. I'm not sure. This is the tutorial. I don't know. Keep that in mind. Wait, are you saying you can see this place from all the way out there? It's my persona's ability. The structure of Tartarus actually changes from day to day. I'd like to join you up there, but we one sec, chat. One sec. I want to move over a little bit. There we go. Okay. We need someone. To... I'm sorry. That's even more concerning. <laughs> now, based on your current location, you can expect to encounter enemies at any time. This shouldn't be too tough, but proceed with caution. You'll get the hang of it as you go. Right. Got it. Let's go, gang. Why is she always like that? 
Man, you were you were making an issue out of absolutely nothing. Right. Let's begin. Defeat all the shadows on that floor. I'll support you as much as I can, but it's up to you to learn something out there. Anything up here? No. Hold on. There's a shadow up ahead. This is Look at him. Look at the little cutie. They'll be fine. We're just gonna gang up on this thing. Right. Let's start by going over how to attack shadows. I'm gonna talk about elemental weaknesses. With an enemy, you have two primary options for fending them off. The first option is to use your equipment. Hate this weapon. The aesthetic of this weapon. I hate this. The second option is to use. This doesn't make sense with his design. But remember, every persona has its own strengths and weaknesses. Knowing how personas work will be crucial. Try summoning yours right now. <laughs> Thank you for the pets. Mm -mm -mm -mm. Get attacked with whatever weapon you have currently equipped on you. While it doesn't do the most damage, it will not deplete your HP or SP. Launching an attack by selecting target in space and clicking space. On the other hand, using a skill will deplete your HP or SP. To use one, press E, then select the skill you want to use. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -da -ba -ba. Bye 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 bye. Hell yeah. He did it. What if he's... We check... Ring! <laughs> I still have... I mean, I still have the same status as before. I haven't eaten in, the, in a minute besides the snack that was uh, redeemed. Considering it was your and thank you for the stretch and foster check and the hydrate. I appreciate that. Don't be afraid to show what you can do. Okay. Got it. Yeah, stop being scared. Good. Let's continue exploring. It's not like our lives are on the line or anything. Is there like Is there like a mouse sensitivity? Because it is ass. Like it's really bad. I don't think there is. Does not look like it. Yeah, I'm definitely for for the next stream when we play this, I'm gonna switch the controller. I do not I'm not like this. It's weird. Another shadow up ahead. Plus I'd love to just be like super cozy and be like, persona time. <laughs> the battle's about to begin. Everyone stay focused. <laughs> Mm, 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 mm. The weaknesses? We're gonna talk about that yet? Yep. They have low resistance to. Targeting weaknesses is one of the best ways to deal damage. Not only that, it can also knock enemies down. Knocking down an enemy creates an opening, letting you continue your offense. Mm-hmm. Weaknesses, huh? Done. I'll show you how it's done. Let's go, man. It's such a cool weapon, and then I'm here with this ugly ass short sword. You did it. Absolutely. Attack an enemy with weakness will deal more damage than usual. Enemy is down. You'll be able to attack one more time. If you use this extra turn to knock down a different enemy, you can attack one more time again. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Let's go. I know you want me to use my persona, but I'm not going to. I want my I don't I don't I don't know if I'm actually gonna have to like genuinely fight, so I'm like I don't wanna be wasting all my SP. I did it. Fantastic work, Takaba. You performed as well as I hoped you would. Totally. I can take my eyes off you. 
you try not being a creep? Great. Looks like everyone's gotten used to handling their personas. Leader, take note of each member's strengths and conduct the battle accordingly. The way, the way of them not having to say my, my name. Like, leader, instead of enter name here, enter blank space name here. Oh, I really hate turning the camera on. Mouse, man, what is this? The sensitivity is like... Yeah. I'm literally having to cycle my mouse. That's crazy. Heck? Hey, found some kind of boxy looking thing. Yes, boxes like those seem to be scattered all throughout Tartarus. Sometimes they contain useful items for battle. Seek them out as often as you can. Oh, sweet! So they're basically like treasure chests. Hell yeah! Let's bust it open and see what's inside. Uh, treasure chests in Tartarus contain items, money, and other loot that will make exploring easier. There are many types of treasure chests, so each with a uh, different contents inside. You especially want to keep an eye out for special items that can only be obtained from treasure chests. Medical supplies? Yeah. I think there's only one use for it. If you get injured while exploring Tartarus, you can use items and skills to restore HP or SP. Open the tab menu, select item, and choose a recovery item such as medicine or lifestone. Then choose a party member. Skills work in a similar way. Start by opening the skill menu, select, uh, so open the menu, select skill, and pick a recovery skill such as Dia, and choose a party member. It's best to prioritize Ifumi's HP so that he doesn't faint while exploring. How dare you tell me what to do? Hey. Nah, but like for real though, like I, I, I am the one that's hurt. Hit me with that, hit me with that, yeah. Your rest of you are okay. Yeah, all are fine. Uh, try the chest over here, let's go. Revival bead. Very nice. Shadow detected. I love the shadow detected. Yes, I very clearly see the thing with many arms in front of me. Try sneaking up on them from behind. Make sure you You can swing your sword by pressing control, that's weird, uh, while exploring uh, to slash an enemy. Doing so will start combat. Striking an enemy from behind will trigger a chance encounter. When you have the advantage at the start of combat, if the enemy attacks you first, a pinch encounter will occur, placing you at a disadvantage. Get into the habit of initiating chance encounters to gain the upper hand for an easy victory. You can still swing your sword even when there are no enemies present. They will be able to practice and test your sword's range. It's not, it's literally not. Is it right? It's right control? Specifically right control. Okay. Next, I'm going to explain I was trying to use my pinky and I was like, no, it's not working. First, go ahead and strike an enemy's weakness. I'll keep track of tactical data, such as any enemy weaknesses you've identified. If you ever forget an enemy's affinities, just let me know and I'll get that data for you. You will I give you the affinities. Oh, sorry. The different affinities are slash, strike, pierce, fire, ice, electricity, wind, light, and dark. The amount of damage inflicted depending on depends on the enemy's affinity. Unknown. Uh, affinity has not been used against an enemy yet. Weak, more damage dealt, and knockdown possible. Resist, damage is half, and null. The damage is taken. Repel, damage is deflected and inflicted on the one who initiated it. And drain, damage is absorbed by the target and heals them instead. Yeah, AOAs, let's go. It's a maneuver that engages the entire team in a coordinated assault. We love these. Fives all out attacks were so pretty looking. They're so cool. But it's like comic book kind of look. Uh, when you knock down every enemy, you'll get the chance to execute an all-out attack that will deal significant damage to all enemies. Once an all-out attack is possible, there will be a prompt asking whether or not you want to initiate it. Press C to cancel and space to perform an all-out attack. Choose wisely, depending on the situation. If you are afflicted with a status ailment, or if you are the only one mobile at the time, then an all-out attack cannot be executed. 
any party member is afflicted with a status ailment at the time of an all-out attack, they will not be able to join in. This will reduce the amount of uh, damage dealt to enemies. Let's go. Ah, so sexy. Oh, it looks so good. Hell yeah. Shuffle time. After battles one, shuffle time may occur. During shuffle time, different types of cards formed by the possibilities within your soul will appear. You can choose one of these cards. Each type of card has a different effect. Persona. Acquire a new persona. Wand. Increases experience. Cup. Activates battle support effects. Sword. Obtains a skill card. And coin returns money. Uh, the more uh, the more one mores you get in battle, the higher chance of shuffle time will occur. If you end a battle with an all-out attack, shuffle time will always occur. Now I have a heal on my main guy. Done and dusted. Level three, Orpheus. Dia. Next one's Bash. Nice. opening it's like my body just knew what to do that was magnificent teamwork it's hard to believe it's your first time and more actual like main characters need to fight using a bow it's always like the supporting like female character that uses the bow i want to use the bow man apply what we've learned so far and continue it all right let's go I detect another shadow up ahead. Yeah, I visibly see it again. What you just learned. Oh my god, the button press again. I went for the left control. I've covered the basics of combat now, but the most important thing is making decisions based on the situation at hand. I'll continue providing some. There was a um there was a Persona meets Fire Emblem game that came out a while ago, and it was really weird because it, its whole gimmick was like with the Personas. The Personas were Fire Emblem um, like characters from the past. So like one of them was like Krom, for instance, and whatnot, and Marth and whatnot. And you bring them in, and then they're like, um, you were able to like it was like a dress up thing. All the, the theme was like idols. So you and your team were, would turn into like idol characters whenever they went into the other world and you'd be all like super like flamboyantly idol outfits and stuff. This is my jam right here. Is that Kool-Aid on the floor? Yes it is. The Kool-Aid man just ran through here. Yeah, this this oh I see so good. Are able to possess multiple personas. Are you gonna force me to use the other one? I can feel a new potential within myself. If you have multiple personas in your possession, you can cha use change persona to swap out your equipped persona with another already in your stock. Changing personas will also change your stats, affinities, and usable skills based on the persona you switch to. During battle, open the persona sub uh, submenu to view skills, then press Q or E to change personas. You can also change your equipped persona outside of battle by pressing tab to open the menu. Then navigating to the Persona submenu. You can change Personas at any time, but in battle, you can only do so before taking action that turn. Bufu! Yes, I'm awesome. Yeah, it's, it's good. It's a good song. Beat him up. Fuck him up. I love the, you know. Hi, I have a bow. Excuse me while I run in. Um, Let's go with wands for this one. EXP is going to be very important in the long run. The enemy has been defeated. like he has the ability to summon different personas i suspected as much after the events from the other day but now we know for sure 
Did you just happen to know that or assume that? I think I think you're I think you're coping. It's a good place to stop. There's a device nearby that will teleport you back. Look around for it. There should also be some stairs nearby, but I can't approve any more exploration right now. I'll explore the upper floors next time. Occasionally, you'll encounter a one-way teleporters in Tartarus that can be used to return to the entrance. Keep in mind that, since these teleporters are only one way, you cannot return to the same floor when they where they are used. Okay. <laughs> It's going well, Sunshine, and also welcome in. Very nice and cozy stream. Yes, that particular box is sealed in a special way. The box can be unlocked by its own mechanism, but it needs something else to work during the dark hour. Needs my fist. The twilight fragment I found in my room seems to be reacting. What's that you got there? That reaction. Do you have a twilight fragment with you? Try holding it up to the treasure chest. Locked treasure chest. Special. Locked treasure chest can be found can be unlocked with twilight fragments. Uh, the amount you need will vary from chest to chest, so you want to collect as, mu as much as you can. Hell yeah. The number you need is one. I open. Open my loot crate. Let's go. Snuff's old. It's SP thing, right? I think. Uh, that was that. That's a Twilight Fragment. They can be used on devices throughout Tartarus. You might find more in Tartarus or other locations with traces of shadows. If you come across any going forward, I want to take them. Yeah. Yippee! Let's go, guys. Looks like you found a teleporter. I love that this hostile environment is just like, hey, here's a way out. Though I guess you could argue that all of this Persona stuff is a manifestation of all of our psyches, and therefore this place that is built around psyches would mean that we would create the necessity, and therefore we created the teleporters. Welcome back. So, how you could argue that, I guess. Rather than the place itself facilitating it. Um, no problem. It was very easy. Well, if you gained confidence, that's the best thing you could have achieved. Wow! I never knew I had that kind of power! But damn! Why do I feel so exhausted? Because you were bouncing around like a little kid. You say that, but you look pretty tired yourself, Yukatan. This is different. It's like I'm having trouble breathing. What's going on? That's the effect of the dark hour. You'll become fatigued more easily. Don't worry, you'll get used to it. I have to say, though, I'm surprised. You all did much better than I expected. At this rate, they'll catch up to you in no time, Akihiko. Yeah, I'm gonna surpass you. I'm gonna be the best. I'm gonna be the very best around. By combining my powers with the teams, I was able to stand against the shadows. I sense a strong bond with them. The Fool. Level 2. Just like Yukari and Junpei, I feel a little tired as well. Said, I decided that it would be best to return to my room and rest. I would always say let's rest. Sleepy time, let's go. Mm. I'm exhausted. Let's call it a day, okay? Dude, I can't take it anymore. I'm starving. All right. From now on, you'll be selecting party members to join you in Tartarus. I'll explain in detail some other time. Vivian, you did well today. Now let's head back to the dorm. Uh, you guys did a great job, but you won't have to shoulder the burden anymore. I'll help you out too. Just as soon as this damn injury is healed. Yeah, you know, plot device so that, you know, stronger people can help me. Excellent work. I have high hopes for our explorations. Uh, the Dark Hour will be ending soon. After returning from Tartarus, the Dark Hour the dark hour will end. This will start the next day. Use this time wisely to recuperate from your next expedition. Uh, the structure of Tartarus will have changed by your next ex exhibition. Treasure chests you have already found can be rediscovered as well, so returning could be a good idea if you find yourself stuck. 
<laughs> Let's finish up here. Does that sound good to you? I love this. My god. Alright, uh, rest up and come prepared for your next exhibition. Exhibition. Oh my god, I cannot talk today. Holy shit. Words. Ah, uh, back to normal stuff. Hey, you're in 2F, right? What's with that wary look in your eye? I'm Kenji Tomo Tomochika. We're in the same class. What do you want? <laughs> no, nothing really. Just wanted to say hi. I heard from Iori that you're pretty close with Takeba-san. Is that true? Well, I guess it doesn't matter. I'm looking for someone with a little more experience anyways. Oh crap, it's almost time for the morning assembly. Come on, we better hurry. That concludes the main portion of today's assembly. Next, we'll hear a word from the student council. Please welcome the new president, Mitsuru Kirijo, from Class 3D. She's in 3D? I sure hope she is. So she did get elected. Well, I guess she is the most popular girl in school. Hmm. You can say that again. She's got this intimidating vibe around her. Not to mention, this school's owned by the Carijo group, right? As I begin my term as student council president, I'd like to share with you my vision for this coming year. It is my firm belief that each of us must accept the responsibility of bettering our school. However, change cannot occur without sustained effort and an unprecedented level of commitment. That is why we must restructure our daily lives in order to rise to this challenge. I'd like each of you to dig deeply into your well of motivation and reevaluate your convictions. Strive to imagine a bold new future without losing sight of the realities around you. That is the key. Mm, 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 mm. My own ideas are but one person's vision. For us to reap the full benefits of our education, your participation, opinions, and enthusiasm are essential. Thank you. Hey, what a speech. Do you, uh, have any idea what she just said? Uh, sort of. Sure didn't sound like something a high schooler would say. If it was anyone else. We'd be laughing our asses off. Rude. Aw, oh, I was thinking about getting some McDonald's and then I saw the thing. They switched to the breakfast menu and I'm like, eh. If they switched to the breakfast menu at 2.21 in the morning, man. What is this? I want a burger. I want a straight up burger and they stopped serving breakfast now. That's rude. You know what? I'm sick of this story. I already went over it in the last class. We've got a great poem we can discuss instead. Close your textbooks, everyone, and listen to this. Isolated cloud suspended over the tall, snowy mountain peak. I'm feeling sleepy. If I close my eyes for a few minutes? Yeah, sure, whatever. I can feel the teacher's glare as I start nodding off. It's like my courage is being tested. Get that courage up. Yo, wanna stop by Paulonia Mall on the way back? I remember once my, my teacher jump scared the hell out of me when I was um when I passed out in class once. Cause I was laying with my like my head side like on, on my arms, like looking towards I, I guess technically towards someone else. And my teacher ended up like crouching next to me like kind of like in line of sight of where my face would be and so that when they woke me up when i got woke up i just like slowly opened my eyes i just saw them like a foot away and i remember freaking just flailing and i was like oh my god i was about to punch them <laughs> i was like you are so lucky man <laughs> i'm like do not startle me when waking up man that is the worst time to decide to do that <laughs> I was like, what the fuck, man? And then they tried to spring some like question. I was like, oh, since you know, you seem to know what's going on and felt the, you, know, you could sleep or whatever. What's the answer to this thing? And I was like, it's this. And they're just like, oh, I'm like, like man, I, why are you bothering me? I got like an A plus in this class, man. I'll, I don't need to be awake for this class. It was like environmental sciences or some shit. It was very easy. So easy. I slept almost every single day and still was the highest like graded student in that class. And I got offered by a bunch of students to, like, do their homework for them, for money. 
and like I just decided not to because I didn't feel like it. But in hindsight, I'm like, damn. The amount of shit I could have bought, because they were offering some real dollar, man. One dude was offering $50 an assignment, $100, 100 plus dollars for like, like, uh, like, uh, what do you call them? Like essays. Um, and then like, I was just like, and it was other students offering similar stuff. And I'm just like, damn, I could have made money, man. I could have made bank doing their shit. But I was just like, nah. And then I went home and played Final Fantasy XI, so online, so you know. Two of you to meet me at Polonia Mall. You know where it is, right? I'll be waiting at the police station. Got it? And the thing is, we didn't even get too too many assignments, so it wouldn't have been like We're not hanging out that would mean that I'd have to be doing extra schoolwork every single night. These girls? No, I don't even know their names. Hearing so much chit chat gives me a headache. And they weren't even asking for like a hundred percent, because they knew that'd be way too obvious. So just like yo. I have like a D in this class. Can I like, can you get me like a C? And I was like, ah. So I'd be able to like pick and choose when I choose the right answers. And I could easily make it so that the right and wrong answers differ between everybody's tests. I mean, seriously, just look at I should have. Hindsight, 2020. Especially because I wasn't like working at the time either. I think I was too young. It was probably like 15. So, yeah. So I asked us to meet him at the mall, Junpei and I decided to head over. Wah 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 wah. Well, I just headed there myself. You know the place, right? Let's go. Okay, save. Hmm. <laughs> Mmm. Mmm. Music. Let's go. Mmm. <laughs> it's not where we're supposed to be, right? Yeah, wait, this is the wrong place. Eek! I was too fast to that. I just saw the word mall, and I was like, let's go! I was like, this is not right. <laughs> I was sitting there the whole time, I'm like, wait a minute. Maybe it's upstairs. Sweet and spicy bacon burger. That sounds amazing. What makes it sweet though? Uh, just says sweet and spicy. Hey, one, one, one sec, chat. I need, I, I need, I need to. I'm gonna probably order food. I am starving. But also, like, by the time I finish stream, am I really gonna want to cook? I'm just really sad that McDonald's is on its breakfast menu now. I used to, I would be le I would be more okay with it being um, the breakfast menu if they still had like the um, steak egg and cheese bagel. But the only the last place I saw that was when I was in New York City last year. They still have it, but it's nowhere else. Like I was in Philly at one point, they didn't have it. Uh, here they don't have it. They didn't have it in um, Tennessee. I'm like, what is this, man? I think it's like not an actual popular item, even though it's like so good. It's like so much food too. Like you pay like whatever it was. It was like three three seventy nine or something like that. And you get this huge ass bagel with this huge chunk of meat, and then like the egg and cheese and stuff. And it's like you get all that, but then you pay like the similar amount for like a little smashed up like McMuffin. It's like come on, man. Why would you? Why would you not want that item? Mm. Fortunately, I think my Uber One ran out. That does mean that I'm gonna have to actually pay a charge, like a cost of a, a delivery charge. Yeah, I was right. That is an SP item. Okay. And I, I just came to my head while I was here. Change it back to old fees. Uh, I guess I'll go to Whataburger, maybe? That sounds like a good time. But how are you guys doing in chat? Now everybody's cozy, sleepy, just chilling. But for those of you that are around. And, you know, conscious. How you doing? Does this not come with cheese normally? That's weird. 
Boing. 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 Mm -mm. Damn, the delivery charge is insane. The hell? Man, I never realized how much I actually just love having like the Uber Eats thing, but yeah, it's 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 crazy how much it actually like costs, but it's okay. Um Just to move some money between accounts. Yeah, but we're gonna play this as well, um, for the Wednesday stream as well. I'll probably end up playing it like on a controller because like the the mouse turn radius feels horrible. It feels really bad. So to be a lot like even if it moves at the same speed, not having to cycle my mouse will be a lot nicer because I have to just keep picking it up and moving it to just turn like 90 degrees, and that's pretty annoying. I've never had like such a problem with that, and there's no sensitivities feature, so I'm just kind of like fucked. Um. Sec. All right, I have my whole order made. Let me just make sure everything's good. So my app decides to restart itself. I wish that there was a Chinese food place open at this hour. There's one, but I know that they just basically like microwave whatever was left over from the day, and I I don't want to deal with that. Mm -mm. Okay. Order received, everything good. I think we're good. Yep. Alright. Because it'll be here in 30 minutes. Very nice. Alright, let's get back to this. Sorry about that, chat. Hello, young man. Say, have you heard anything about those mysterious cases of ordinary, healthy people changing overnight? I have. I guess that shouldn't be a surprise, it's all over TV. Oh my, how did I forget to buy shampoo? No rush, just wait for the sale. Isn't Saturday the sale day at the pharmacy? Yes, it is. Wait. Duty pass, the police station, turn around. I was just... Oh, okay, I think it wasn't close enough to the door. Okay, fair enough. I was like, what the fuck? Oh, sorry. Oh my god, I zoomed out. Go small lane. Wah. Okay, there we go. <laughs> uh, how's P3R been? It's been good. It's been good. It's it's very nostalgic, but like refreshing, I guess. At the same time. He helps keep our squad well equipped. Oh, and here, this is from I need to charge my PlayStation 4 controller and play through. Um. Uh. Play through the rest of my five campaign. I don't know if I have Persona 4 on Steam. I don't know if I have. I have it like everywhere else. I have it. <laughs> I have like two copies for my PlayStation. I have it on my PS2. Well, PlayStation 4, PS2, PS Vita. I don't know if I have Persona 4 though on PC. There's also P. Uh, I got. I could just start over with Persona Five and get it for My job is to Steam, and then stream it as well. I don't know. We'll see. I don't like playing too too many long games like this on stream. Just because it either ends up taking like means that like the best thing for me to do is play like six to eight hours of it on stream multiple times. And it's at that point like it becomes like a battle of commitment, right? Like maybe I don't want to play it twice this week. But then, like, if I play it, like, spread it out between weeks, then it just takes too long to get through it, and I'm like, I just want to beat the game. But, we'll see. Uh, Tatsumi East Police Station. You can purchase equipment for you and your party to use in battle. You can also sell any equipment you aren't using if you need a little extra cash. There's no telling what dangerous Tartarus will throw your way, so be sure to gear up with the highest quality equipment you can afford. Equipment is listed in four categories. Weapons, armor, footwear, foot, foot, bleh, footwear, and accessories. And uh, I think it feels good. I'm down for whatever games you play. Yeah, I wanna, I'm also gonna start on, um, I haven't been playing Hunt as much. 
So I'll be actually um, starting eventually on um, on YouTube probably a like road to being like a badass solo player <laughs> in Hunt because uh, I don't really play solo that much and when I do it's just like it, it's literally just um, I, I, I'm one of those like scummy solo snipers. Not as like cowardly as like a lot of them, because a lot of them will just like hold an angle with their sniper for like 30 minutes, get one kill, and then just like leave the game to save their KDA or MR. I'm like, I don't play like that. I definitely like reposition, move around, and whatnot, but it still wouldn't be fun content to watch, at least not in the form of like a YouTube video. Maybe on Twitch, like people would be like, whatever, but like on YouTube, it's not that fun. So, like, I want to take the playstyle that I play with friends of being a lot more hyper aggressive and mobile and apply that to being solo, which is something I haven't really done um, because, oh my God, this queuing into randoms, like random trio queue is the most pain ever. The inconsistency of skill is insane. Like out of any shooter game I've played, hunts like MR system and the players that are placed in different MMR brackets are so inconsistent. I'll go into one game and I'll get somebody who's a lower star rating than me who's popping headshots every two seconds. And then I'll get somebody who's like higher than me and they just like, they see an enemy and never shoot at them and never like notice that they're like right in front of them and then die to a shotgun. And it's just like, what the fuck, man? You know, it's just so inconsistent. At least like going into almost any other shooting game, Siege, Valorant, whatever. It's like, you can kind of see where these people are coming from. Hunt is just like, the MR system is so like volatile that like, it just might as well not exist. It almost should not exist. I say almost because matchmaking should always exist, but like, it's just so bad. It's so bad of a matchmaking system because all it takes is you being a baby little player who doesn't know what they're doing and you get two lucky kills and now you're in a higher bracket or being a really good player and unfortunately dying to somebody um, a couple times and then you're in a lower bracket. And so it's like your, your things can change so much. I could be like, I could play for like two hours and switch between brackets three or four times. Like, and that should not be the case with it. That's like if you played Overwatch or something and you just went from like bronze to gold within two matches and then back down to bronze from one match and then you just went up past that, up to diamond or something like that from two more matches. It's like, that's how it is. It's just so fucking volatile. They need to change that. So I definitely want to um, get better at being a solo player so that like i don't really care about where my rank is and it's definitely going to be even more inconsistent being a solo player um but being solo and not having to rely on the inconsistencies of matchmaking would be really really nice so i figure i can actually like record that and make that a thing for youtube which could be interesting and who knows maybe like a year from now i'll be like a total badass but for now i need to get better at being doing the aggressive play style that a lot of youtubers do but without the reliance upon having teammates to back me up or fill in any gaps of skill or or decision making and stuff like that. Because usually I can make those risky plays, but then I know worst case scenario, my teammate behind me will get me up or capitalize on the kill, which I won't have that ability as a solo player. So that's something that I want to do as a recording um, and then keep like longer form games like this on Twitch and then I still have some other like short horror horror games and stuff like that I have to record too for YouTube, but I've been exceedingly lazy these past like week and a half and all I've done is make like short content. So I need to really get back into the swing of all of it again. Some new things in stock. Check it out. Uh that what you want? Yes, I want weapon upgrade blues. Yeah, I sell the old one. Put the rainbow. Arrow chose leave a rainbow trail. Oh my god. I want rainbows. Um. Uh huh. Take as long as you need. What are you looking for? 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 Hmm. Okay, those are the same either way. Accessories, what we got? Uh, Vitality, Magic, Agility, Luck. Okay, stat boosters. SP and HP will probably be a lot more better for that, but let me... Let me go for this. What'd you bring? 
How many? You're sure. That's it all done here? Yes, I'm good. Let's go. Come back soon. If you want to buy anything, you know where to find me. Drop by anytime. I believe the police station selling weapons. What's more? They only gave us 5,000 yen. Ain't that kind of stingy? I mean, kind of saving the world. I mean, to be fair, all the stuff we bought for 5,000 yen is pretty, pretty impressive. I gotta go. Not gonna lie. Like, that all was a steal for 5,000 yen. Well, about that. I'll leave the rest to you, leader. Let's meet up again. Oh, no way. There's a ton of shops and stuff in this place, so you really should check it out while you can. All right, see you back at the dorm. I love whenever I drink and blink into oblivion. Funniest thing. At least I don't do the uh, <laughs> the like super jump scare anymore, where I just go super close to the camera and my neck breaks. Uh, so today you're free to use your after school hours as you wish. Make use of the school activities. Academics charge occurs. Yeah, I need to get into a club. Open the number of activities you can engage in in a day is limited. Think carefully about how you spend your time. Yep. That is the most challenging part about um. Persona games is balancing your delving into the dungeons with the um like the social social network building as well as um just, you know doing what you need to do to improve yourself. Uh competition's heating up. I gotta make my store more unique or I'll be sunk. I'm starting by making Saturdays regular sale days come out this weekend and support my store. Uh yep. Okay. Yeah, dungeon crawling and slice of light combo, yeah. But that's something I like about it. There's not really um there's not really another JRPG that really does that. Where it kind of has this like focus on relationship building, but then like it's an actual like component. Cause if they do it, it's usually just like, hey, you wanna fuck this character? Here you go, do this. It's not usually like an actual thing you can gain by building the actual social links up and stuff like that. But then you have to decide between Doing that, dungeon crawling, uh, you could do stuff on your own as well, and that just becomes a whole other thing. You can partake in uh, services offered by various establishments in town. By doing so, it will cost time to pass. Many businesses will raise your academics, charm, or courage. High stats may help you build new relationships. Uh, depending on what game you play, you can increase all of those stats. Okay, yep. Yeah. The arcade cycles throughout weeks. Yeah, okay. Should you spend your time here? House of the Deceased. House of the Dead is solid, man. Real well, okay. Um, You know what? I can't even afford that, unfortunately. You really got to time manage if you want to pull off its lot in your first playthrough. Yeah. Which is why I'm going to play it very comfy. Like, I could sit here and plan out every little possible thing and try to... Try to make sense of it all, but it's gonna be so stressful to be like, ah, oh, let me like min max this. Cause that's what I usually do. I play on a harder difficulty, and then I'm like, okay, how can I optimize my social links, my, you know, whatever it may be, training, my self training, and then exploring. I, I usually I end up going into like Tartarus or whatever equivalent is in the game, um, and getting as far as I humanly can until I notice that like I'm actively dying. And then I pull back, and then I'll focus on, like, building relationships and stuff like that for a bit. And then I'll go back in. Um, is usually how I end up doing it. But, we'll see. I'm gonna go with the flow. I'm not gonna stress, it's my revisiting of my childhood here, you know. Hello there, my my. You look like a pleasant youngin. What are you doing at the shrine, though? You don't look like the prayerful type. Me? Well, I've come a long way to pray to the god here. He's a strong one. The offertory box and the written fortunes both bring great blessings. Then there's Inarisan by the Red Gates. Ooh, some crazy things might happen if you pray to him. But you have to pray you have to pray for a long time. It's no problem for me, but some people might be too busy. Leaving money as an offering. Leaving money as an offering will raise your academics. The amount you choose to donate may yield different results. Those who approach with generosity will be rewarded in kind. Time will pass if you make an offering. Yeah, let's 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 burn money. Let's put a thousand. Let's go. Pray, clap, clap. I put money in the box. After making an offering and praying, it feels like I've been blessed with greater intelligence. 
Hell yeah. It's getting late. I should head back to the dorm. Uh, perfect timing. I'd like to speak for you for a moment. Let's see. Wait, you can't play as Katona? Uh, oh wait, no, yeah, no, you can't. Never mind. Pain. I mean, was she in the, wait, was she in the original one? Or was that one of the, the remakes? I forgot. Going to Tartarus, you may now venture into Tartarus at your discretion. You can go there by talking to your allies or by checking the bulletin board in the lounge. Because Tartarus is unavailable until the dark hour, time will pass if you decide to make the journey. Give yourself ample time to prepare beforehand. Also, since I'm sure there are other things you will like to take care of, you have permission to go out at night if you need to. Well, that's all for now. Keep up the good work. They released that the FPS epilogue story will be released as DLC, but Katone as a playable. Uh, really? That's bonds. The business offers nighttime exclusive items and part time jobs, so see what you can discover. Okay, how's your boxing gloves? Officer Kurosawa can't experience the dark hour. He's just an ordinary policeman. But he knows what we do, at least in a broad sense, and helps out where we can. Uh, why does he help us? Well, I don't know how he knows about our situation, but regardless. He seems to be simply following his own convictions and doing what he thinks is right. He's a good man. And you should be glad to have him on our side. Armorous is, is, is shrimping it up. Hmm. Is something the matter? Oh yes, I see the posture check, sorry. <laughs> thank you, thank you. I'm actually, I've been sitting amazingly these past two streams, but the stretching definitely helps because my neck gets really stiff. Um, just wanted to chat. Right. You may go out at night, but please use the appropriate discretion with this privilege. Hmm. Yes, mother. Tartarus just drains me for some reason. You know how the air is thin at the top of a mountain? It kind of feels like that. What about you, Sabakun? It's not so bad. Oh, is that so? Well, I guess you're tougher than you look. Hey, you know that thing we uh, use to summon our personas, the evoker? Well, I was thinking, uh, why does it gotta look like a gun? I mean, you gotta be a little nutty to point a gun at your head and pull the trigger, you know? I mean, we are pretty nutty. For me, it's your shoulders. It that's that's fair. I, I do build up a lot of tension in my shoulders, but it's actually more so in my neck just because like I'll do things like um kinda like I don't know. I kinda like lean the weight of my head sometimes like on a point between my neck and my shoulder sometimes, and so then it'll kinda like just pinch up my neck. And so I gotta I gotta get a better at like my like head posture rather than um um like my body. My body's fine. What kind of nut? Peanut, cashews, walnuts? I like cashews, I like cashews. Mm. Ah, night time, let's go. Uh, let's go to the strip mall. The cans, they're good too. I, I prefer them baked into things though, than, um, rather than uh, like eating normally. Uh, hey Wenya, how you doing? Wild bug ring. 1,000 yen. The ingredients are a secret. Eat the burger might help with your courage. I don't have the money for that, though. Check what can be done here. Oh, it's gonna say that again. Okay. I don't have... Yeah, I don't have the money for that. Uh, looks like it's closed. Yeah, fair enough. Mm-mm-mm. This is closed, too. Can you please walk right? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go inside. I hope they still have uh, the P4 references. I mean, they should. They definitely should. There's actually DLC for the game too to have like Izanagi and stuff. You did very well for your first night in Tartarus. So what do you think of it? Uh, it was a piece of cake. Fantastic. That's absolutely remarkable. Would you like to apply to become the next chairman? 
it, that's all it takes is me being like, wow, it was easy. I'm, I'm, I'm a cocky teenager. Like, damn, that's crazy. Uh, yeah. Everyone seems good. Various schedules. Okay, let's go to Tartarus. When his name changing color there for a second. Went from orange to green. <laughs> This will be our temporary base of operations. I'm counting on you to take charge during the operation. During your turn in battle, pressing W will open the tactics menu, which will allow you to change how each party member will act during their turn. Direct commands allow you to control their actions. Act freely. The party member will choose the best course of action according to the situation. Full assault. The party member will prioritize attacking. Conserve SP. The party member will choose an action while saving SP. Heal support. The party member will riot prioritize their HP and focus on recovery. Direct commands, the party member will act according to your player input. Tactics can also be viewed and changed through status in the menu. Go to status and use Q and E to toggle from check status to tactics, where you can change the tactics each party member uses. Damn right I can. Hello, Igor. Can I can I do fusions and stuff now? Not that I have Expendable personas, but I have been anticipating your arrival. The time has come for you to wield your persona cards together. They can be reborn into a new form. One could call it a fusion of personas. There is much hidden potential within your persona abilities. We've never had a guest show this much promise in the past. Oh, thanks. I know. I'm quite. I'm quite special. I know. Establishing social links, you may be able to create even stronger personas as well. Oh, ho. this shall prove to be most interesting. To that end, as you accumulate cards, please bring them to me. Um. Probably the limo. Like the pr the prison was okay. This is I think this one's metal as fuck. Like I think this one's probably like the coolest. I think, but my favorite is the limo. You can borrow Ego's power to fuse new personas in the Velvet Room. Fusing personas is crucial in over uh, overpowering enemy shadows. First, try fusing personas in your possession. The following Velvet Room tutorials have been unlocked: Persona Fusion, Social Links Fusion, Skill Inheritance, and Persona Compendium. Hi, Elizabeth. I don't have expendable personas to fuse, but. Let's say, like, I don't even have the money to bring, like, another persona to the table. Ah, uh, yeah. Yep, 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 cool. Registering personas. Will you register it to the compendium? Are you finished? Yes. Why do you say it like that, man? Are you done? Rich, get the fuck out! Damn. I'm sorry. Y'all want me to be here, man. Okay. Alright, let's go, friends. Oh, that reminds me. Discuss our first goal for this exploration. According to our research, Tartarus is divided into several different regions. We continue to climb the tower, then we'll eventually reach a spot that leads to a new area. Reaching that spot should be our first goal. Are you all ready? Let's go. Remember, don't push yourself too hard. You can always use the teleporters to return. You can always go back to the highest floor you've reached that day. And yes, here, take this. If you ever find yourself in danger, don't hesitate to use them. Thank you. That's all from my end. Good luck. Later. Each floor's dimensions may vary, but don't feel compelled to explore every inch of the new layout. Rushing directly for the stairs is a completely vi uh, viable strategy. I leave that choice to your discretion. You can dash by pressing and holding shift, left shift specifically, while moving. Uh, you'll cover ground more quickly, making your exploration of Tartarus more efficient. However, enemies will spot you more easily when dashing, so be careful. Right. Just leave everything to yours, truly. Eight, how I have to then... I have to turn my camera with my mouse, and then melee with my my uh, keyboard specifically the right control Isn't this the school 
way? But now it's all distorted and creepy. It's not creepy. What's the plan? Wah! Yes, two. We have you to attack. Oh my god, buddy. Why'd you miss? Enemy down. Keep that up, Yori. Looks like a regular school, right? Beat him up. <laughs> Shuffle time, let's go. Uh, give us a single shot. Hey, he did, Junpei. Where that Mitsuko's persona can double as battle persona and a navi is really impressive, honestly. That's true. I had a, I had a time when me and a group of friends who were really, at the time, we were really into persona. Uh, we all, like, made our own, like, characters and personas, and there was art of them, too. Like, we actually, like, <laughs> commissioned art and stuff. Super nerdy shit, man. Super duper nerdy. Do I... Did I miss something? Whoa! You're likely to find a plethora of these strange mineral deposits scattered throughout Tartarus. Supposedly, these formations are the crystallized remains of shadows, and sure to be useful materials inside them. When you find one, try cracking it open. Yeah, I've already been doing that. Yeah, I've been doing that. Thank you. I mean, I've done the same in that I've pondered what persona would be mine based on the themes of each game. Yeah, I've, I have done that, and I admit to that big time. Granted, I think my primary thought has been this particular game, but that is also because it's my my first Persona. I played this one, then I played 1 and 2, and then 4 and 5. Ah, fire. Fire bad. Nice. Watcha! You go! Hell yeah. Let's go level up. <laughs> Thank you for the luck, Prinny. Much appreciated. Oh. Yeah, I'll just do a normal tech. Uh, this might be your weakness, or it might be ice. Ah, oh, it's ice. Gotcha. Doesn't matter though. Oh, you suck, man. You suck. You get beat up. Oh, get shit on. Hell yeah. More crystals. More annoying mouse movements. Actually, can I... Um... Let me see. Uh... Let me see. Battle? Maybe? No. Wait. I can attack with my mouse? Oh my god, I can use my mouse this whole damn time. That is so much better. That's still horrible because of how the mouse controls, but... Hey, let's loot that chest. So much better than hitting freaking... <laughs> hitting right control. Uh, 
I uh, keep a running record on hand of each area you explore. Give me one sec, I'm gonna check my order. Uh, Joseph has your order. How close are you, Joseph? Uh, he's five minutes away, okay, so we might be able to get through this area and then I'll have my food. It's a treasure chest. And then we'll take a food break. Cause I am going to devour that. I'm not gonna wait like I did last time. Mmm, like 800 yen, nice. Washa. Go over here first. So many ways to go. There's a shadow. We got the upper hand. The only shadow. Good hit. Oh, it's not your weakness. Fair enough. Just kill you anyways then. Nice. I love the smile on my face. I'm just like, yay, we did it! And that's a wrap, folks. With the power of friendship, we can overcome anything. I'm gonna lie, didn't even notice it. Cure water? Doesn't feel as good of a reward as you could get from a purple chest, but you know. A shadow. Nope. All right, let's do this. Yeah. I have to do this. Oh, your wind. Okay, fair enough. Weak to wind. Okay. Do this again. Beat him up. Finish him up. Fuck him up. Oh my god, they're going fast. They're <laughs> They're like already here. Uh, let's just get more EXP. Done and dusted. Level up. Level up. Level up, level up, level up. Nice. That's the stairs. Give me one sec. Uh, it was back here. Over here. Look at it. Okay, so it's just wandering around, yep. I'm hoping there's a teleporter on the next floor so I can, like, get out and, um, just eat without having to just stand somewhere. I mean, I could pause, but still. Mm -mm. I don't like her persona. Never have. Never have. Out of buns. Um, the XP. We did it. Yes, we did it. Oh, pretty well. Oh, there's nothing else besides that one thing. That's all right. That is additional EXP, which will be great in the long run, especially when trying to balance uh, social links as well. It'll be good to have a lot of early EXP bonuses, kind of compensate for any time we waste outside of Tartarus. Yes, we're going to leave because my food's about to be here. Otherwise, I'd go fight them right now. All right, let's get out. Let's see, go ahead and select the first floor on the device. That should bring you back. I would I would give you all, but I, I need food inside of me. 
Why is this a teleporter? Oh, you're gonna talk. Never mind. <clears throat> Once activated, you should be able to travel between any of the other devices. Be sure to activate any you come across. They'll be quite useful during future expeditions. Uh, yep. Yep, I understand. Thank you. Ba da Bow down down. Uh, let's call it quits for today. I mean, I could have just, I guess, AFK'd and then done whatever. It's okay. Next time we come into Tartarus, we'll go as far as we can. Try to optimize that um, that stuff. Uh, dude, was a rumor about you and Takeba-san coming to school together even true? Uh, well, no, on the first day. Only on the first day. Sure. Yeah, well, it's not like I care or anything. Anyways, you must be uh, pretty unlucky to have to transfer here. Wait, you seriously don't know? Weird stuff's been happening at this school. There are a couple of folks who say they're hearing strange voices. But I guess since you're always wearing those headphones, you probably haven't heard anything. Yes, it's my it's my fuck off devices. <laughs> my favorite thing was always wearing headphones, clearly being like, hey, I don't want to talk. But then people would just like insist on talking to you. And I'm just like, man. I'm like, yeah, I would wear them sometimes not even playing any music just to be like, do not talk to me. And people would still just be like, yep. No reason, really. And then I have to sit there and be like, dude, it is like six o'clock in the morning. Please stop. It's violence o'clock. Please stop. I'm going to hang out with my classmate after school. According to Igor, the strength of social links is the strength of the persona. I decided to go with him. Ramen? Yep. Now that's what I'm talking that or was something completely different. Was I right? Soup here tastes great, doesn't it? Completely different kind of hangout. Put some special ingredient in it. Something no other did they go into the wrong apartment complex? A secret clue in the shop's name. They did. There's a, we, we share a lot with another apartment complex. And if you go straight, you go into our complex. And if you turn right when you come into it, you go into the other one. And they're not, they're not connected at all. The roads that do connect them are like gated. And like not like the gate that you can open, just like actually like closed and like chained. And so I watch people all the time go into the wrong really? apartment complex. Man, I wasn't expecting that. I think he'll 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 figure it out. That I'll get a message in a second. Just hoping he doesn't call me because I have my service off right now. Because <laughs> I don't ever use it. He just messages me through the app if he needs help. Uh, seems to be having a good time like me. A voice is ringing inside my head. I am thou. Thou, thou art I. Thou hast established a new bond. I'll have a blessing when thou choosest. The Magician Arcana. classmates. When you meet certain people in school or in the city, you may develop a social link with them. When fusing personas, these social links will affect the result of the fusion. When you fuse a persona that has the same arcana as one of your social links, the resulting persona will gain a uh, bonus experience. Trying to establish relationships with many people to enhance your persona's capabilities. What? It's already dark? Damn, I missed my favorite show. Man, for real? Oh well. Oh, let's get going. Recorded on VHS, man. <laughs> you can now receive invites via messages from your social links. After you visited a business at least once, you'll be added to their mailing list. Visit different facilities to receive updates and special offers. I decided to return to the dorm. Let me see if this guy has found his way out of that uh, other apartment complex. I think I think he has. Welcome back. No, he hasn't. 
<laughs> is he really just gonna go in a circle until he's like, damn, I'll find this place eventually. It'll eventually show up and make sense. This may go without saying, but it's impossible to do business at any stores at, during the time. So make sure you're uh, ready in advance. You don't want to be caught unprepared when it's too late. This man's really struggling. He's literally going in the same... So the thing about the neighboring development is, is it's literally just one big circle. So the fact that he hasn't found the place in two loops, you'd think he'd be like, hmm, <laughs> something sus here. I always feel like there should be like a room here. Every time I like come over here, I'm like, oh, totally. There's a room that goes over here. It's not. Also, this is a really fancy seating area for um for what this is. Like, this is really nice. Na -na 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 Computer on the desk here, I wonder if it belongs to somebody. Of course it does. Like a store, uh, storage room, it probably contains the dorm's equipment and such. Mm -mm -mm. All right. You know what? Let's see. Is he okay? No, he's not okay. <laughs> he's not okay at all. Uh... You know what? We'll we'll wrap up the stream here uh, a little bit earlier than usual. I figure we've all we usually go for like four or so hours. We're at three hours. I gotta eat. It's gonna take up like twenty minutes. By the time we're done, it's gonna be pretty close to being done, anyways. So we'll actually wrap it up here. We'll continue this again on um on uh, Wednesday and go to the next part and go from there. So I hope everybody's enjoyed this and just chilling, having a good time with Persona. Nothing crazy, not my usual horror or anything like that. It's been some nice, cozy um, Persona and chill. It will get more chaotic as time goes on and we're having to fight harder enemies and I'm dying to things. But for now, it ends up being some pretty nice and comfy, uh, comfy stuff to enjoy. Um, I thank you everybody who's been here with me. Let's see if um, we got a live right now. Who's playing The Last of Us? Uh, mm -mm, let's see, we've been raiding Imp a lot, so let's avoid that for now. Uh, na -na 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 -na. There's actually not a lot of people online. You know, we do have somebody who's also on P3. Let's go re raid them, because that is fitting then. Raid out. There we go. Um, yep, so we'll be back Wednesday with um, Wednesday night with more of the Persona. And then Friday, we'll be doing some Labyrinthine with, um, for my first time, I think also they're all first time. Um, we'll be doing that. Um, and then um, Saturday, we'll be doing some more Project Zomboid. So. And this time, it'll be <laughs> hopefully a little bit better because we'll actually all be uh, prepared to go in and ready to go. And everybody needs to learn the game a bit better. Um, which I'm the only one there that has, like, I think, I don't know, no, Rain knows a, a bunch about the game too, but um, myself and Rain are the ones that know what's going on, and then Kieran and Garrett are new to it, so we'll go from there, though. But I appreciate, again, everybody being here for the follows, hanging out, making sure I'm hydrated and stretched and everything, because I definitely get really zoned into what I'm doing. Um, I will see you guys on Wednesday for more. Uh, shooting myself in the head with a pistol to summon my inner self. Have a good night, everyone.